Ah, we live. We live, guys. Oh, me. Rush, rush, rush. Yeah. What's going on, guys? I'm out of breath. I had to rush from a little dinner that my daughter and them was having. Make it up here right on time. Well, I guess it's better being a little late than not being here at all. We'll get started here in a couple of minutes, guys. I got to take a quick bathroom break. Uh, got a good lineup for tonight. Going to have some fun. Kick back, relax, wherever you're at tonight. And uh, I just bit my tongue. Actually, out there, I was doing the twist out there at the uh, restaurant, at the party. So that's another reason I'm out of breath. Yeah, it's humid and hot outside. And hey, everybody saying, hey, hi, I'll be right back. How's everybody been on this beautiful Friday? Y'all remember when you hear this sound tonight, y'all know what that means, don't you? Let me take all the notes off of here that I got. Get some of my working material down here. And we get this auction started right tonight. Everybody's out enjoying this hot, humid day. Yeah, Fowler, if you gave us your uh, meteorology report, Gail's our meteorologist here in Allen County. She's a uh, recliner meteor meteorologist. <laughs> meteorologist. Uh, what's it doing out there, Gail? See, she said in the recliner. <laughs> Guys, we got most of our Fire work permits and everything entered today. Next week, right here, we'll be opening up our fireworks building. June the 10th is the date that we can first start selling fireworks here in Scottsville and Allen County. All the permits go through everything all right. About hot and humid and dry. There you go. You heard it from Gil Fowler, Allen County's. News weather meteorologist, and she might throw in a little gossip every once in a while. We may have her start a gossip column. You think you can do that, Gail, or one of those uh, dear Gail? My dog don't yeah, like Gail. me, my wife don't like me. What do you want me to do? Hey, Apache, heaven for. But anyway, guys, the crowd will build up here in a minute, 
and we did get that package, and we haven't looked over everything yet to give y'all an appraisal. And you know who I'm talking to? I think I'm talking to the right one. Lambert? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. You guys ready to buy some good bargains tonight? The reason I don't look directly into the camera, guys, I'm always looking over here at the, uh, the big flat screen TV. And that way... That's love, live, live and leave. TV. Love, the live, TV. and leave. Put the TV right at the camera, right in front of the camera. Just yeah, we'll, we'll do that to where I'm yeah. actually staring at the comments and the camera at the same time. Yeah, we're going to have some fun tonight. Like I said, we got a lot of great items. Uh, besides uh, myself auctioneering tonight, I'm going to try to be as lively as I can. And when I can't be the all intelligent, which I don't know if that can happen, Uncle Jed. We'll be the silly Uncle Jed tonight. All right. If I can catch my breath, we'll get it rolling here. I need my black box. We got the black box coming. I'm going to keep this bell hood under here. That way nobody can see when I'm fixing to ring it. Set this right over here. What is this? First item up for sale tonight. It's not a Razy Cotton picking sight uh, item. It is a magnetic dryer she sheet dispenser. This is 3D printer filament. Oh, 3D printers. Yeah, check that out. Oh, I gotta find my phone. And these, you put this on the side of your uh, dryer. Isn't that cool? It's got magnets right here. Isn't that cool right there? Whitmore magnetic dryer sheet dispenser. That is so cool. You know, you could probably do uh, like wet ones on the side of your refrigerator with that. You could probably do some wet wipes with that, I think. They might not stay fresh very long, but that is a cool item. Somebody said it about $5. And I'll tell you, I only got two of these. I guarantee to sell one of them, but I only got two of them. And them are just as handy looking things as you can have. Magnetic, put your dryer sheets in there. You don't have to wonder where your dryer sheets are. They'll be right there. Uh, magnet, magnet, mag magnetically stuck to your dryer. Adam at three, four, three dollar video, four, three, four. Three dollar video, four, three, four. I'll be one of them at that, and I just got two of them. I got Stacy Scruggs. I was just talking about you, Stacy, to uh, Debbie Wicks. Yes. That it was just in here. Mm -hmm. And it wasn't all good, I'll just say. No, it was. I was wondering why you hadn't picked up your money, but I told her you could use it uh, here buying stuff. Same thing, same difference. But I'm only at $3 on that, Mama. That's It's just going to be one of them. I'll take the other one home. Mama done said she'd take the other one home. Take up your I got to go. Here. Oh, Deb Frady came in at four. Deb's in at four. Five. And the husband's in at five, so which one do y'all want me to? There we go. We got $4 bid, Stacy. And Mama said she's taking one of them home, so I only got one of these. It was all good. It was all good. I'm telling you, it was all good. <laughs> it was all good, girl. And I'm at $4. With Deb Frady, Stacy, I need a $5 bill. Like I said, India's, I, I done described it to such a perfection. India's taking one home. And then maybe she'll learn how to wash clothes and drive. Where's she at? She went outside, didn't she? No, You'll be lucky if she did. I'm at five first with Stacy Scruggs. Guys, y'all bidding slow tonight. I'm fixing to start dropping the hammer fast on some items. Ain't going to play no reindeer games tonight. I mean, five dollars with Stacy Scrubs. Yeah, I gotta go, and we'll need a phone set up to make sure I catch a bid. So, oh, no, Deb Freddy came in there. Good night. I ain't never worked so hard for a dollar, but a dollar is a dollar. Stacy said she's out. All right, Deb Frady, 
going in and out of here. Mom, did you say you wanted that? Keep that other one. If I get any more in later, guys, I'll let y'all know. I figured that'd bring at least $10 or something. Guys, raise your cotton picking sights on this. This is a Model A4. I can't read all of it. A charging stand. It's gone, long gone now, Sandy. Wireless charger base, iWatch. Ooh, it's iWatch 2. Wow. You charge your iWatch. And we just got one of these. Your phone. And your phone. And uh, does it charge one of them iPads and stuff too? Look at that, guys. And it's got the little stand and everything in here. And I don't know what that one does. Yeah, I guess that's for an iPad right there, Ricky. That's for your watch, maybe. Yeah, you're watching stuff. That's for your watch. Cool, cool things, guys. There's the uh, adapter right there. You plug them in. You can charge your phone. As long as your phone has that, uh, I can't think of the terminology. You can put your phone on there, your eye watch. It's got a USB output, and then, of course, the input. There's all your instructions and all that. And we're only at $7. Lordy me, this may be a short-lived auction tonight. Probably a $40, $50 item right here. You've got to have, I forget the terminology for that. Somebody help me out. Your phone's got to have a, like any of his iPhone 8 will work on it. Uh, and if my iPhone had that, uh, I can't think of the terminology on it. Well, I went from uh, Android to Apple. I'll let them put all that back in the box for me. But there it is, guys. Brand new. We're only at $15. And I got to go. $15? We're at $15, Ricky. Well, we ain't got very many on it, Gary. I don't know where they all at. They call it out. Honky tonkin' there, honky tonkin'. Man, just out. You think everybody's out honky tonkin'? It was uh, her and Israel. Israel's got QI it. QI capability. Uh, there you go. I looked all that up before. You're right, Israel. There you go. It's got to have the QI capability. And I'm at $15, guys. Looking for $17.5. I've got to go. That's well worth that. That's going to be a deal. You guys that's got on here early tonight, you're going to get some deals. I'm not going to hold nothing back, no reserves or anything. Let's come across something later on in the auction now. That might be a different story. I don't know. And $15, there you go. We're not we're not waiting around. They're not in there. Gail, I bet you right now probably got a cold one in your hand. You're probably looking at your window at all the guys going down the road, and you're singing, hey, hey, good looking. What you got cooking? How's about cooking something up with Gail? Because I got a hot rod for it and a $2 bill. I just live right over the hill. I'm in my recliner and I know you'll dance with me. <laughs> there you go, Gail. Gail's going to beat you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about that, fella? And we have a... Happy, happy watch. I think that's what it is. No Xbox 4s. Oh, my goodness. That's nice now. I'm a telling you. Isn't that nice? Nice little kid watch. Or I guess an adult watch. That'd fit an adult. That's pulling the dark numbers. I can actually see those numbers. Yeah, now if I get you a feller out there here it's in a, a nice little bit. Watch. What's 
kind of watch is I get it? some kind of matchmaker funds. It's a happy, happy watch, Ricky. It's nice. It'll make you happy. If I owned it, I'd be happy. Because you'll look at it and it say, well, it ain't 5 o'clock, but it's 5 o'clock somewhere. What would Jimmy Buffett do? I want to look at that watch. For $5. I think it's a nice looking watch. It is indeed. And the crowd's building up a little bit. This it is works. the lowest crowd. That's a nice watch. <laughs> that is a nice watch. <laughs> How about I keep the Ford in the $2 bill, Gail? And I'm only at $5 with the watch, guys. That's a nice watch. Did, did everybody get notified? Did people not get notifications that Uncle Jed's live and on the air? It's not a great big watch, Sammy, but it is a nice watch. I'm at $6, Bill. Would you go 10? 16. It's bigger guys, than a woman's gonna, watch. Not going to bigger long. than a woman's watch, but it's nice. Well, you got to go. I'm at seven dollars, guys. Man. You better get the bids in there. I'll pick and drop the hammer That's on nice. it. That's nice. Got seven. It's nice. Does the letters on it light up? Well, I seen a battery. There we go. We're at eight dollars. It's on the empty box. Hey, and it's got an extra battery. It does have an extra battery. Yes, it does. It's a battery that goes in it. It's an extra battery. And they were like $5. It's got an extra battery. I can't battery. get it to focus. I will. It's not. It's got a black leather-like band. On. Is it leather or rubber? Rubber. It's a rubber-like band. I'll put that down in there. Put that aside. And we're at $20. Need 22 and a half, and I gotta go. Joan, it's well worth it. Get on in there. I'm gonna be grabbing the next item up on the price is right. All right, guys, I told y'all I'm dropping this 22 and a half, going and out of here. John Tuck. We have the bag of bomb. Uh, where's my loop? This use on dry skin that can crack, split, and chaff. Hands, feet, elbows, knees, cuticles, lips, and face. Rubbing the skin and allow to remain for full effect. Since 1899, bag bomb has been the farmer's friend, moisturizing and softening dry, chapped skin caused by the harsh environment of Vermont. Bag bomb. I think this is like an out. Sealed and everything, guys. Look what I found. Yeah, everybody, Christy was saying it it's like good stuff. Pig. There's a cat. What's it do? And I think they glow in the dark. I believe they do. Yeah, smoke moms, that's what I think. It's a little one ounce jar. You know, you pack it around in your purse easier like that. I've never heard of it, but I reckon a lot of people has. And I'm at $5 with Joan Tuck. It's good for cow letters, too. Yeah. <laughs> Look at and that you know, and you know they, they sell these on Amazon for about $7.99. So I'm going to drop them Uncle Jed price $5. There you go. I'm gonna sell it at five dollars. I think they sell them on Amazon for seven ninety nine. Yep. I've not got I've not got that many of them. Unless I find some more later on. So whoever wants um uh Joan Tuck take as many as she wants. Smokes mom says she sells they were one ounce. They are one ounce, they're all sealed. We'll sell them at five dollars each, guys. And we looked them up on Amazon. I think they're seven eight bucks. About right around eight dollars. So I didn't want to go past that. We wanted to beat them. And here they come at you guys. I'll tell you how many we got. Joan Tuck's got to tell me how many she wants. And then everybody else can get just get in line. I'll see how many I got. 
John Tuck takes two. Here they come, guys. Y'all got a pen writing them down? I'll tell y'all how many I got, and there ain't that many. We'll count them out here. Ain't them once one. John Tuck, two. Mo got two. Kathy Grant takes one. Brenda Spears takes one. Amy Dorito takes two. I've got a total of 20 is all I got. So when we get to 20, we got to stop. Yep. When we get to 20, we got to stop, guys. I got no, baby. Four, six, eight. Two, four, six. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, I think you'd ask smoke moms. That's pretty you good You can price. use it on your hands for calluses, blisters. Jade or no, good. she's from up there in Vermont where they made this stuff. Or I don't know if they it's still make it there or not. But I've got uh, 11 of them left. Did you get Amy Dorito? I did. You can use it on cuts. Made in good old Vermont. There you go. Still Since 1899. Fill in the box. Uh, Mo, Mo takes three takes more, so we've got more. seven left now. Told you. So I what did bring last night? Uh, I don't remember. 50 or 60 bucks. We need 50 something. Was so it 55 or 60? So, so they brought 50. And okay, we'll just pass them out as that. Come on, guys. Yeah, Smoke Moms, I read that. We won't sell I mean, we got left seven of them. Surely, to goodness, I can sell out my first They're item good. tonight. Only 65 people here. We can probably offer them later on in the night and sell the rest of them. They better than Carmex. We've got seven left, guys. I'll tell you that. At $5 each. I think they'd be good on a coach. Ashley Stinson takes one. That makes me have six left, Christy. They're, it's good stuff. Six left. You get something wrong with your lips, get calluses on your hand, you ask them old farmers, they say, go get that what was bag it? bomb. Oh. I had her down for the wrong number of the, the uh, pencil. Okay. Too many or not enough? Not enough. Okay, uh, gotcha. We got it. Okay. Uh, she did butter, go. Butter, butter. <laughs> All right, we'll pass them out. How many we got left? I'll pass them out later on tonight. What do you have to start? Oh, Sammy. Sammy takes two. Sammy takes two. That leaves me with, uh, I think, four. Yeah, we need to start with. Yeah. We'll find out how many we got left, guys. All right, raise your cotton picking sights. My goodness, guys. Sammy wants one. I only have three left, guys. And we'll sell them out once we get up to about that hundred mark. Look at this great gift idea right here, guys. Ooh, wait. Uh, I'll tell you what it is. What's what in it? it got in there? What's it got in there? A bath scrubber thing. Is that a towel? It's got a sponge. Towel and a hand. That's a sponge up there, Jerry. That's a sponge? Yeah. That is a sponge in it. Uh, like a, what is that? Just open one of them up. Them ladies know. What's a loafah? Oh, we can retie it. A loafah, she said. <laughs> it's got a sponge in it. Two. Two sponges. That's a scrubber now. Hey, Feel that? Yes, it dark. is. And I don't know what that. What's that? What's that model? right there with the? Uh, oh, okay. on your yeah. back. Oh, you, you can, can wash your back. back with it. Oh man, how neat, Christy! I need one. <laughs> and then that's a sponge, boy. You talking about getting some of that dead skin off? That other old soft places. Enough you get water out. Yeah, that's a nice gift set. I can retie that. That's I think. a foliating sponge. I'd there. get one of the yes. ladies to retie that. Six bucks on there. On uh, mode. I'll get them to retie that, I think. I might be able to. You can't tie it. I'll get one of them Somebody to retie will get one it. That ain't <laughs> but we guarantee to sell one of them, and I think I got three of them. And we're only at $6, so there's only going to be one Seven. at that price, I tell you. We do, have, we do have three of them. But we just guarantee to sell one because we can throw it up in the antique mall. Got seven. I think it put about $20 Mo's on out. it. And that would sell. Oh, they quick. are pretty nice. They are nice. 
and we've got three of them. We guarantee to sell one of them, guys. I mean, that's ready to give right there for weddings, uh, anything like that. Yeah, that back scrubber's got handles on it. I might take one of them home. But we're seven dollars. There's just going to be one of them, and I'm fixing to drop the hammer. Seven dollar baby to go eight. Seven eight. Seven dollar baby to go eight. Seven dollar baby to go eight. I just don't think they're looking at this at seven dollars. Wow. I ain't gonna play around. Seven dollars gone. Only one. Gone and out of here. I don't know how they tied that. But... All right, guys. Didn't nobody want one? Just. Yes, I did. Didn't yeah, you did. Oh, you're learning though. You know. It? Yeah, you caught me on that, Jerry. Y'all caught me. All right. The foot pill mask. What's going on, William Thomason? You're fixing the sale, Ricky. Here in a minute. Now, what do you do with this, Ricky? It's a foot pill mask. Repair rough heels. Foot pill mask. Get soft feet. Repairs your feet. It's got a, the boot in it. I think Mo bought some of them here a while back. Something like them. Ex exfoliating soft. It softens your feet up where you can just get the skin right off. That's what that does. It takes the skin off the dead. Somebody set her in about $10 and let's off. go. Let's try it on your Is feet. Is that right, Christy? You don't try one on your foot? You don't think I'll put my foot down in one? They I, might not it, want it. I, I don't think I'd put it on there. I wouldn't do it personally. I ain't got rough skin on my feet. Somebody said here about 10 and let's go. $10 be to go 10. $10 be to go 10. 10, 10, $10 be to go 10. Two, two and a half. Two and a half, five. Two and a half, would you go five? Two and a half, would you go five? Give them open. Lavender Senate, it's two pairs in there. Two pairs. Two pairs, That's guys. I like mobile here a while back. Something similar to that. Yeah. And I'm only at two dollars and a half. I don't know what kind it was. I'm at five with Mildred. Yeah, most right there. Five dollars. I'd say you'd probably what spend fifteen, twenty on that at least. I don't know, Jerry. I've never had nothing. I don't know. I don't I've know had my feet stuff. washed in church before. Have hey, you ever had your feet washed washing. in church? Foot washing. I yeah. know. I didn't. I had five, seven and a half. Five dollar bill to go seven and a half. Done it. Five, seven and a half. Five dollar bill to go seven and a half. I didn't get saved at a foot washing. Did you? Yes, I did. That's when I got saved. And we're only at five dollars, guys. I don't know where I, what's going on tonight. I think everybody's struggling. Like I got him over here. Five, seven and a half, five dollars. What about six? I gotta go. Five, seven and a half, five dollars. Five. So did the mold. Going and out of here. First penny item of the night. Mildred, I figured them would go for ten or fifteen. So Mildred, you get a pay a five dollar item for a penny. All right, moving right along, guys. Mike, I sell anything. If you've not ever noticed that. All right, nice little item right here, guys. Oh, my God. This is uh, if you want to crush up your own medicine, only one we got. I like it. You're welcome, Mildred. Just for decoration. Eh? Well, you can crush up a lot of people's into those herbs and herbs, things like that, and uh, spices. making their own vitamins, and all that stuff. Uh, what do you call that? That's called the mortar, and this is the pedestal, yeah. right? Yeah. Pedestal. Yeah, I guess you could grind up herbs with it. Good thing, Sandy. Glad your surgery went well. Somebody sent me in. I got $5 start bid on that nice little That's wood nice. piece right there. It's nice. Where's Sandra Whitehead at? She it's usually nice. likes this kind of stuff. Yeah, that's super nice right there. I got $5 with Moffitt. Well, who made it? Uh, it's on the bottom of it. 
I couldn't make it out. Rusty City. Rusty City. And got an elephant on it, too. The bottle. And I'm only at $5. I'm learning, Jerry. You're teaching me. <laughs> Is Edna Brown on? Uh, don't think so. Not right now. She may be watching. There's a few more on her than what it was. Uh, we're at $6. Six. Was it Sandy's foot? Got surgery on. Got six. Can we get seven? We're at six dollars. Wow. Nice. What's wrong with we may have a short auction tonight, guys. I'm telling you. Yes, she does. Got a well, nice little item coming up here next. I'll tell you what. I hope Kathy Scott's on here and I didn't make her mad. No. No, she's. I hope she did get mad at me. I thought she was behind. Kathy Scott don't get mad, Ricky. She gets even. Yeah, I don't want her mad at me. Wow. I don't think I've ever sold one of these wooden ones for $6. I don't know what's going on tonight. Sammy. Uh, I'll Sammy's be looking for you one, Mike West. I don't know if folks didn't get a notification. Did crush. I say something to make somebody mad last night? Did I? You could crush, crush your medicine up for your dog and stuff like that. Yeah, you know? anything like that. Yes. If you like me, I can't swallow like big pills. So I'd crush them up. We're eight with Mildred and uh, business slow tonight, guys. I do have some case double X pocket knives for tonight. And I don't Lord. know if I even put them up or not. Where'd you? I ain't seen them. I'm at eight dollars. That's it. Eight dollars selling. Wow, that. Mo, you get some good deals tonight. Jerry. We'll go as long and as we can stand it, but I don't know how long we can stand it's it. Wood. We've got a nice kids' uh, There's five headphones here. Kids' wired headphones. Got stickers and everything you can put on there. Pretty nice outfit. There they are right there. Aww. Aren't them nice for a little kid? Somebody set me in at 20 and let's go. Do you want to keep any of these? Go in the dark. Face masks. Face masks. <laughs> Just like Bennett James would say. And I'm only at $5, guys. Wow. We're at $5 with Wanda Sexton. Yes, yes, you can, Amy. Uh, who is Bucks King? I don't know. You got to be registered, Bucks King. We can't take your bid unless you are registered. They'll put that. Uh, we've just got we got seventy two. Call up all your friends. Call up over your neighbors. Y'all sure? time. Jimmy Moffitt's at Soft six dollars. Wow, well, well, we're only at six six bucks. A lot of people's orange. probably out getting their yards done, Still things nice like that. Out. Yeah, we have seen two hundred people on here before. And we are at six dollars. Seven, Seven. Eight. There's Wanda. Jeff Reynolds is on now. Uh you're welcome, Amy. Okay, Bucks King, you know why it matters? Because this is what Hey, somebody you. somebody get rid of Bucks King He's right now. See ya. I don't like your attitude. See ya. That's why it matters. Boy. We good people here. Boy, if they, they got attitude tonight. What's it matter? <laughs> Thank you, Paul. Bam, going and out of here. What's it matter? They're paying. These people. <laughs> that was a troll trying to. Uh, is Edna on here? Uh, yeah. Takes all kinds. Takes all kinds. I'm at $8 with. Uh, thanks for being one. Jeff Reynolds, 8 bucks. 
Bars are open. Bars Paul are said open. bars are open. I knew there was some people out honky tonking tonight. I think everybody should still be careful though. Uh, eight dollars, Jeff Reynolds got to go, guys. That's gonna be a steal there, Jeff. And I sold it eight dollars. People can always drink. Wow. It. You know we we're giving stuff away tonight, Riggy. I'm giving it away. Drink it home. We'll be here all night. We won't even make your goal at four We ain't, we ain't going to make my goal, period. <laughs> period. Because oh, yeah. I do something. All right, let's put up something. Let's put up a big item. Mike yeah, West said, we'll give him something. <laughs> Mike, you come up here and I'll give you something, all right? We're going to give out any more <laughs> penny items. I can take you all right, now I can say raise your cotton picking sights. <laughs> all right. Peroxy. I don't even know what it is. Easy to use and effective. One button operation. Designed with easy carry handle. Ideal for full age application. I still don't know what it is. Easy to carry. Still don't know what it is. One button operation. Full age application. Easy to clean outdoor and indoor use. One year warranty. I still don't know what it is. Look on the side of it. Is that one of them uh, breathing <laughs> things? I don't know what it is. I believe it might be one of them breathing things. I believe it is. Oh, it is a nebulizer. It's a nebulizer. Oh, it's a breast pump. <laughs> hey, no, it's a. Uh, you need one because we got one. <laughs> A yes, yeah, it it's is. A it is. It's got everything oh, wow. in it, brand new. Nice. Hey, that this it's is nice. a nice one, guys. There we go. It's a nebulizer. No, it's, it's, it's got not for your feet, Jeff. It's got everything but the medicine. It is a nebulizer, cameras. You're right. Got it all in there, guys. Pretty daggum nice. We can slide it back down in the box. It didn't say on the box. Ten. I got ten with Jimmy Muffet. 10, 15, $10 video, 15, 10, 15, Ricky, you're going to have to get all this back in the box here in a minute, we'll wait till we get her sold there, and a half. but there it is, guys, hey, there's Kimmers, hey, we're 12 and a half, 20 now, 12 and a half, would he go 20, 12 and a half, would he go 20, 12 and a half, would he go 20, <laughs> got 15, got 15, Debbie Stenson, <laughs> Seventeen and a half with Mo. It ain't popped up. There it is. Twenty with Barry for you. Twenty with Barry. Not right. handy. Especially I knew I'd finally get some up early. If you get light. sick in your lungs and stuff, you got, have some of that medicine. It helps you. What is that stuff well, they put in there? Well, Mike, she's just not on here yet. Albuterol. Albuterol. That'll open you right up. Just wait till she gets on here, and I'll remind her to put you in timeout for a little while, Mike. Keep I've from heard going you've been, to the doctor. I've heard you've been a bad boy. Gotta get out of here, Twenty-five, thirty, twenty-five dollar go thirty. Twenty-five, thirty, twenty-five dollar go thirty. Got Barry Purdue in twenty-five, twenty-five. <laughs> Mike said, "Okay, I got twenty-five, thirty. Moon told him she could help him. <laughs> <laughs> got twenty-seven and a half. <laughs> yep. Grateful asthma sufferers. Yep. 27 and, a half, 27 and a half. Now 30. 27 and a half to go 30. Got 30. Now 32 and a half. Y'all just keep on bidding. The next item, I'll go ahead and preview it for you. So y'all be getting ready to bid. It's the Forridden Hair Straightener, guys. Oh, oh it's my. Profes it's professional. A professional, Ricky. Thanks for bidding, Mildred. Y'all had some. $30. Is everybody done? Mildred Dunn, appreciate you bidding, Mildred. Out. Very Purdue. Very Goodbye right there. Yeah. About that work. It's mine. Professional hair strengthener. Uh, strengthener. Straightener. Oh, looky there. Looky there. Oh, my. It's got a comb in it. It's got a glove in it. And looky there. Wow. These ain't cheap, I'll tell you that, guys. They are not cheap. Somebody sent me in about $30, and let's get it started right. Let's rock and roll. Yeah, surely $30, eh? Surely. Surely. Quit calling me Shirley, Ricky. My name's Jerry. 
Jerry Shirley. Uncle Wayne. Jerry. Remember that movie? Remember that movie? <laughs> All right, somebody said they're about thirty dollars and let's go. Thirty dollar bid would you go thirty? Thirty dollar bid would you go thirty? Thirty dollar bid ten twenty. Ten twenty. Ten dollar bid would you go twenty? Ten twenty. Ten dollar bid would you go twenty? Got Jim Moffat in at ten. Let's go twenty. Twenty. I got twenty now. Twenty five. Twenty dollar bid go twenty five. Uh. <laughs> all right, Jill. We'll just re keep rolling on there. Uh. Uh. Where am I at? $20 bid. Were we at 20 Yeah, 20 Yeah, with me. Oh, I got 20 with Christy Shields over here. 20 25 I got 20 with Christy Shields. I can type it in. Oh, uh, you go ahead and type it I'm in, yeah. Phone. That way they'll know. Okay, there we go. It's a higher strike. I got 20 now 25 You've been on bunch of these last night. Never got them, didn't you? Yeah, you better hope Vanus ain't on. Vanus, oh, Van Van he'll snatch that right hey, up. Vanus. Got, got in there while I was typing it in. 9, 25, 30, 25. They make cheap, I don't think. I'm at 25, guys. Y'all keep on bidding there. I was outside. 27 and a half. And Venus got it right out from underneath me. Oh, my. We got a six-piece stackable fridge bin coming up next. It's your shelving on it, too, Jerry. And, guys, I, I do have some case time. double X pocket knives. Kimmer sinks for bidding. We've got 30 with Deb Frady in. 35. 35 with Christy. Michelle there. Your name Christy Michelle? Yeah. Oh, okay. We're at 35. Deb's out. Christy may win this tonight. 35, 40. 35 dollar video, 40. 35, 40. I'm going to start lowering her down, guys. I'm having it. I'm having it. We're at 35, 40. 35 dollar video, 40. Thanks for bidding, Deb and Kimmers. So did Christy Vanus. Wonder one tonight. Vanus. They was playing 50 and 60 yeah. last night. Vanus knows that he can resell his stuff. Vanus said he knows that he's passing. Vanus Thanks, knows he can Vanus. resell his stuff. You yeah. got both of them from me last night. <laughs> All right, I don't know what. Oh, I've got that coming up next. Yeah. All right, raise your sights here, guys. Only one we got, six-piece. Stackable oh, fridge bins, easy to clean, maximum storage space. Organize your entire refrigerator or that's pantry. That's pretty nice. Good that's for cold drinks and everything. That's the way it looked before. He and, said I could buy one for his cost. Is that what he said? Yeah. Vanis, I'll remember that. No Star Wars for Vanis, Ricky. No. <laughs> she said not to say you know Star Wars, Vanis. This is a neat outfit. But I won't right listen to her. <laughs> We're at 10, 15, $10 bid with you go 15. 10, 15, $10 bid with you go 15. Nice. Hold the cold grains, eggs. I'm at 12 and a half now, 15. <laughs> that is pretty nice. Six pieces. Mike, I do have some case pocket knives. We're still looking Gamers. at storage units no to get some of the uh, fishing poles and things like that. Mo's in at fifteen dollars. Yeah, knock Kimmer's out of it. Looking for twenty now. Mo come in first at the fifteen. Mo back in there at twenty Kimmer's. It went seventeen and a half twenty with Mo, and then you came in with twenty two. Deborah's out. Deb Brady. Got Mo. Martha Kinslow, 22. Mo comes back in quick with a 25. You were ready. 20, 27, 50. Six piece. Holds eggs and everything. Cold drinks. Put vegetables in one. Separate everything. We got 25 with Mo. I think India does have a little bit of jewelry tonight, Cameras. We're at $25. Are they done, Riggy? I think so. Sold Mo's them out. Got it. So, Mildred going and out of here. All right, guys. Nice item right here. 
These are, you activate the decals by placing them under a lamp for three minutes before peeling them off. Peel off the decals and press them firmly onto a flat surface. Turn off the lights, completely darken the room. To recharge decals, expose them to the bright light for at least five minutes. Glow in the dark solar system, guys. Pretty neat item for your kids' room, uh, for your science room. They're glow in the dark. I guess pretty neat. Wall stickers, planet, and stars. You're getting planets and stars. Glow in the dark. You just recharge them. And I'm at two dollars and a half. At three dollars. Let me see your pocket knife, Ricky. I don't want to rip the thing. No, I don't rip it. I got coins in it. I'll take the coins. Five. I'll give you that 50 cents. <laughs> Six. Vanis. Oh, yeah, I see what they are now. Oh, that's. Nice. Oh, good night. They all glow in the dark, Ricky. It's the whole solar the system. The moon is that the that's the sun. It's big. It is the whole solar system. Seven. Shana. That is so cool. Shana eight. Ten. Venus jumped in there at ten. Went from seven, eight to ten. With Venus Brown. Oh, it's got look at there. They're vi they're vinyl there. too. They feel, they feel vinyl. <laughs> Twelve and a half. Penny Coker. Twelve and a half. They've got the stars. Jupiter and Mars. He's still working on me to make me what I used to be Penny or Coker, need to be. Twelve bucks. Took him just a week a to make the moon and stars, the sun 15. and Earth and Jupiter and Mars. Pretty neat little package right there, Ricky. Pull out Uranus. I wouldn't even know what Uranus looked like, Mike. You wouldn't. <laughs> oh, God, Jerry. Penny Coker, Shauna has it at 12 and a half. Shauna's got it at 12 and a half. Uh, I'm Penny, a, Coker. Penny Coker. Penny Coker. I'm going I'm I'm to sell them. First. I'm going to sell them at 12 and a half, but I'm going to back them down to $10 each. I've got a few of them. Ricky, uh, hold them up there for me. I'll see how many I've got. He's got a few guys. Take care of uh, uh got to take care of no, Penny, the Penny Coker Penny first. Coker, how many would you like? One, two, three, four. Twelve and a half. Did, five, what did you say? Six, you marking them down to? Seven. Ten dollars each. each. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Penny 13, wants one. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. 17. I have 18, 18 of them. 18 of them. 18 Penny of them. Wanted one. Back them down uh, to $10. Let everybody that Mildred gets to read. Hopkins wants one. Don't call them off. I'm reading. Yeah, she's reading them. We got it there. Thank you. Okay. It makes it easier for me. We see all y'all's bids or how many you want. Y'all just keep typing them in. She'll tell me when we, we get to them. 18. They're pretty nice. It shows you how to put them on the wall and everything. You got 12 left. This ain't got Jupiter on there. Uh, how many do I have all together? This got Jupiter. It ain't got a Pluto. And we've sold seven. Got, got six. 18. Got six more. Got twelve left. No, got uh, eleven left. Said you oh, eighteen. We got eleven left. Mercy. Yep, eleven of them left. You told me not to tell you. We got eleven left, Ricky. I've got them counted here. What we need? Ten dollars a piece, guys. Shauna got them at hey, twelve fifty, and he backed them down to ten dollars. Our Penny Coker got them. Has Penny and, told you and, how many she wanted yeah. yet? And they backed them down to 10 bucks. Whoever wants one. See how many one. Martha wanted? Whoever wants one, just let us know. We've got a uh, little boy would like it. Little girl might like it too. Wants one. 
11 of them left, guys. 10 of them left. $10 a piece. Give them for Christmas gifts. Great gift for your grandkids. Martha said just one. 10 left. Why ain't, Gail, why ain't Pluto considered a planet? I don't know. They ruled it out, I reckon. Did they really? Yeah. We've got 10 of them left, guys. Let's move them. wonder why. It's ice, ain't it? Uh, Vanus could answer that. Vanus. Ten of them left, guys, at $10 each. Why ain't Pluto a planet anymore? All right, Ricky, go and take him that way. It is again. Oh, it is again. <laughs> it's the dwarf, dwarf planet. planet. Hey, what's the giant blue one they've seen on the other side of the sun? All right, gone, gone and out of here. It, it's six times bigger than Earth. I know Vanus knows what I'm All right, guys, about. we've got an area rug here. Hey, this looks like it's straight out of the 70s, Ricky. What is that? It's an area rug. Huh. I don't know how big it is. Oh, that it? is 70s, if that's a rug. Maybe we can get it folded back up. Yeah, I'll fold it up. Uh, they didn't get, uh, Debbie said she didn't get, was it on your invoice, Debbie? Debbie Wicks. What is that? Uh, okay. Was it on her invoice? Yeah. What is this? Give it to her. Look here. It's my dog. <laughs> <laughs> Not a dog. There went that sale, Ricky. <laughs> it looks, it looks like, like a bear. It's a, is that leather on the back? What does it say? It's a, like a suede. It's an area rug, but it's shaped like an animal. Seriously, guys, like they caked it out or something. And I mean, it's furry. It's sort of pretty like nice. It's like a bear, I guess. I guess it is, or a wolf or Actually, something. Like weasel skin. Great. Actually, weasel skin. It's got like leather, some type of leather. Yeah, it would be, Jade Moon, a great prop. Uh, this is about what, Ricky? Five foot? Yeah. About five pretty foot. Neat. That's pretty neat right there. It feels really soft. Yeah, it feels real. We'll get it folded up. It feels real. It says uh, area rug. It could be used for a seat cover. We'll get it back in there. It's the only one we got of them, guys. See you later, Fido. <laughs> you out of here. <laughs> Somebody bid <been> 250. <laughs> Three. Five, I learned your sale. <laughs> ten. I was thinking about it. Feels like see, you made me think about my dog, Joe, that I had for 15 years. Oh, I'm sorry, Jerry. And he died. I'm sorry, Jerry. Now, don't yeah. get emotional on me now. Look, don't yeah. you? That looks like somebody. We are at ten dollars. <laughs> We're at ten dollars with uh, Don. But it is leather on the other side. Suede, like, it's suede? Like suede material. Yeah, it's pretty neat. Ten with Don. It does. It does look like what they used to put in a Chevy van. It does. She woke up and took me by the hand. Twelve and a half with Sandy 15. Boy. Fifteen with Don. It's pretty neat, Don. It feels like real hair. It does fur. That's a good idea, Brian. What for the? We got fifteen with Don. Sandy Boardman's out. Prop for a baby Sell photo. it. Ain't nobody else bidding. Yeah, use it for a prop for a baby photo. So the Don gone and out of here. Don't think bad about that as if the baby was allergic. And I tell you what, that might not be good. Well, that's what Don was buying it for. He didn't want it now, Rick. Oh, it's pretty nice. It is, <laughs> but I'm just saying, make sure they're not allergic. Definitely. Fifteen bucks. Don got a good deal, or Kathy. Yeah. Uh, we got film. <laughs> she don't find me. I'm funny. Get off the camera. She don't find me funny. He's hilarious, guys. Look here. Boy. Oh, dude. yeah. We'll, hey, we'll remind them of uh, what them cost last we night. To, we didn't buy it now. He, he carries on all the time. 50 bucks, and we found two more of these, and they nice. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to start them at 50, so if somebody wants a bit of more hire to get them, instead of going to buy it now, that'll give everybody a chance to yeah, start there's bidding. there's only two of them. Yep. Uh, this is Film Who. 
a leading manufacturer of productive film for the latest mobile and electronic gadgets, including cell phones, mm-hmm. digital cameras, smartwatch, and MP3 players. Uh, high definition, scratch resistant, strong adhesion, uh, something mm-hmm. and something coating case friendly. Yeah, Dom, we hope you're feeling it's a screen protect, protector. Uh, My knife's not still on. Okay, Debbie, we'll get on I'll keep this little bitty one right out of here. Okay. Her pins were on the invoice. She was just not yeah. giving them. Yeah, Debbie, um, we got them, honey. We're sorry. I was, talking we got to, them. I was talking to her and everything. There we go, guys. There's three of them. That's got all the stuff in there you need. What they playing? That's a Samsung 10. Samsung 10s. They'll fit anything like that. They no. Trim them up. Or? There's three in each pet. Oh, I guess you could trim them, but they're for a Samsung. I got another one of these, too. Where does it say that on there? What? Oh, right Samsung, Samsung Note 10 Plus. There's another one of these. Okay, yeah. We saw one of them. And there you go, Jay. That's what oh, they are. That's real. What nice. is that? Oh, that's one hey, of them. That looks like a, a whale one. Like a yes, Amy yeah. Dorito. Yeah. That is neat. Can y'all read that on there? Samsung 10 Plus. Yeah, they were Amy uh, Dorito. I didn't 10 pass plus. Those. Okay. It's got three of them in it. Now, these are going to be very cool. I love them. Yeah. Those are really cool. Amy, come in there at 10. Yeah. Uh, let's sell them at 10. Then. How many you want, Amy? I think she was just saying it fits a 10. Oh, it fits a 10. Okay. Yeah, it's a 10. I think that's what They're probably about They're 20 probably bucks. Worth 10 bucks. She might Surely. Been I don't know if she's bidding or not. We just don't have to get it tonight. <laughs> it's because I'm up here aggravating him even more. He was already aggravating. No, she said 10. Okay, let's pass it. I'll tell you what. I've got quite a few of them. Uh, okay, sorry, Amy. Let's, let's, pass them at, uh, let's pass them at $8 a piece. And there's three of them in there. Amy, we're going to pass them at $8 a piece. And there's three in there. Three of them's inside here. But not $8 for the three inside. That's no. That's $24 each. I'm <laughs> saying there's 23 in this box. Or not 23. <laughs> now you got me messed up. There's three inside <laughs> each Amy box. Wants three. Thank you, Amy. Uh, that's Thank you for three. Anybody else Anybody. $8 a piece? Cindy Petty Go, do you need one? Jim Moffitt, do you need one? We'll sell them at eight dollars a piece. Eight a piece, got three of them inside. I'm trying to see which ones these fit. You're right, Amy. Three times eight bucks. <laughs> yes. You're right. And that's a lot of screen protectors. I'd put them in my pocket and break them, is what I'd do. Jim's gonna pass. Jim's for eight bucks or ten bucks. No, $8. $8? Yep. Jim passed. We ain't got no more beaters. Anybody. It's all right. We're $8 for a 10. Piece. And here's some more of this. I've got one of those. The other one's on this table, I think. Well, Jerry, I think, I think we table. sold three out of that boat. All right. Move along, Rick. We're moving on. Sandy Petty got one Oh, got it. Sandy, got we got in, Sandy. Got Anybody hand. else? Anybody else on them? Fits a 10. All right, move along. Ricky. Hey, look here, guys. He said move along. Put that one up. Right. It went in that, that bunch. It's still to have four already. Yeah, somebody picked it up. We sold these last night for $50. But we need to start out at fifty dollars to see how many. Well, what we, we is, got? Ricky? We got two of them. We had several people wanting them, right? So uh, we're gonna have to start them at fifty. That's what we sold them for last night, and we got two of them. So if anybody wants one, try you to get, make it fire. 
yeah, we're going to make it fair because somebody might want to pay more than what they paid last night just to get one of them. These are the That's all we got. hammocks, two person. Two what people. was the weight limit on it? 600 pounds. 600 pounds. 600 pounds. I could get in that with my wife. <laughs> well, Amy, if you, ever need, there. if you got any friends that need any of them, let them know that we'll, we'll pass them out at that hunt. But we got two of these. They sold for $50 each last night. They are the hammocks. They've got the mosquito net on them. They're we need to start them at $50 tonight. And if that's all they bring, we'll pass them still. We got two of them. We had several people, they might not be on tonight, that was wanting them, and we just had two of them. You got 18 people on here. And they are not. Nice. Might not be the same people, though. Yeah, true. On Camel the hammock, flies. $50, guys. For camouflage. Two They're person nice. hammock. Got the screen on it. We'll kick the bugs off. Mosquitoes. Most. All right, I got a starting bid of 50 there. And if nobody else bids, that's what we'll sell them for again tonight. They're nice. We're not going to carry too long. I just wanted to make it fair in case somebody wanted to bid. I didn't know how you wanted A little to higher, that. yep. Instead of passing them, you know, I know they're worth probably 75, 80, or 100, I guess. <laughs> Pretty sure. And that's my educated guess. I don't look like nobody else. Let's just pass them at 50 then. First two people, Mo got, we got two of them, Mo. We got two of these. I guess you'd have to offer it to her. Yeah, Mo, Mo can take up the two, and then anybody else, first one that says me, after that, can get the other. He takes them both. They're gone. There you go. I tried to make that fair, guys. There's the only way I could do that. Thank you, Mildred. These are um, microfiber towels. Got All right, guys. The gym. Yes, it does. That box is coming undone. Well, maybe I can take it out of there. <laughs> These are the Milk Pros Professional Milk Frother. A frother. Now I can't remember. We had some of these. Uh, we had some of these a couple of weeks ago. I can't remember what they brought, so we'll just bid them out. Nineteen thousand rotations per minute. I've got a black one and a red one, and we'll take it out this one out since the box is already open down here. And show it to them. And it's soon be Will of Whitney time. And I love the colors of these. Yeah, that was really pretty there. But it's got them black ones. They're battery operated. Oh, He's thinking about for selling, Christy. I'm going to ramble tonight. You know, I've talked on the phone all day, and I've heard people talk all day long. I've worked all day. <laughs> You're rambling. But I ain't one of them people that you talk to on the phone. I'm on the internet. Hey, that's got a really soft handle on it there. And I you could probably like uh beat an egg or something with that, couldn't you? I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know why I don't I've never frothed milk. It's not weird to throw some batteries out there. And then froth it. What's okay. Froth? <laughs> I have no Good idea. Good can you make milkshakes? <laughs> that's the only thing I want to know. You can make milkshakes. I can blow through a straw and get bubbles. Choice on them. Guaranteed to sell one of them, guys. Kimmer said she goes to the coffee place. We don't have one of those here. Dennis said it works really well. I've got $5. I don't know what it does. I seriously don't. Oh, they're too flimsy to make a milkshake. We got $6. For the I'm at 6 There's only going to be one, but I guarantee to sell one of them. They need Doritos as you can. Scramble an egg. You know, to make to mix up an egg. Creamers. Well, I bet that would beat an egg real good. I don't know. We yeah, should throw batteries in there. Really oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Use it for an omelet. Amy said you could. Probably so. Or to put batteries in one of them. <laughs> it, yeah, it comes with the stand. Yeah. Uh, and we got six with Sandy Boardman. Venus knows everything. Venus bought two of them. He knows exactly what they do. Seven. We're only at seven dollars. Y'all killing me, Petey. Got ninety-four people. Got eight. 
Are we landing, Jerry? There, Danny Vance. Little Miss Betty Crocker. Kimmer said husband beaters. Right, there's only going to be one of them, and right now i got Sandy Borman. I don't know, but I believe you got 20 bucks out of them or more. I don't know. Vanis, what did they? Vanis bought one. What didn't bring Vanis? Before. I don't remember. $15 before. Oh, he said they brought 15. Vanis said they brought. I thought they did, Vanis. Jumped in at 10. We're at $10 with Danny. Yeah, they were fifteen dollars each. Is what Vanis gave for them. Like and Danny, uh, Vanis is not bidding that fifteen. No. Oh, thank you, Gail. I wasn't waiting for. <laughs> I got women always telling me what to do. Blah blah blah. Twenty nine at the store. Twenty nine dollars at the yeah. store, guys. That's why Vanis I said there's only going to be one of them. Vanis no. There's only going to be one of them. I've got a few more than this. And we're a third of the price at $10. And I'm going to sell one to Danny Vance. $10 going him out of here. Same color. Done gone, Sandy. Too late. Sorry. I'm just going to let one roll at that. Danny, you want the black or the red one? I had about four of these. Venus did get 15. Yeah, I remember. I, I knew it was better than that. Sorry, Sandy. It was too late, girl. Uh, Danny Vance, you want uh, what color? a red or a black one? Just one. Uh, whichever one you want, huh? Black. 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 All right. Going and out of here. Thank you. All right. Going to keep right on rolling here. Let's do some baseball cards. Let's mix it up a little bit. Thank you, Danny. Thank everybody else for bidding. If anybody else wants them, uh, fifteen dollars. That's half bucks, price. That's what Vanus get for one. Fifteen dollars. That's half price. It wouldn't be fair to Vanus. Well, it's a different option, so it wouldn't yeah. matter. But uh, that's half I'm price. <laughs> These are football yeah. cards, guys. In great shape. All football cards. It says uh, 98 96 tops football. Rolling tools. Yeah, it's a different auction now. We could have let them roll to look like that. I don't. It says 95 upper deck on I don't this. Think we got no tool chairs. Let's make sure these are upper deck. Ten. Wow. Ten everywhere. They are upper deck. That's good. That's what they are on that. That post it note. That's good then. I ain't 95 upper deck. upper deck. Guys, I'm gonna get them back in there without trying upper to mess deck's them up. A better card, ain't it? Uh upper deck's pretty good. That's what they are. 95 upper deck football cards. And we're at 10 with big kids, small toys. There's a lot of cards and cards in the boxes. I forget how many cards them hold. Probably about what, 500,000? I don't know. It's got like a thousand. I'm at $10. I need 12 and a half, guys. One of one's got a thousand. Something wrong, guys. We're going to let uh, Ricky finish up with that one. Then we're going to do the Wheel of Whitney here in about 10 minutes. Ricky, go ahead and finish up with that. And and sell, Mike Higgs and whatever that is I next. Will. That helmet? Yeah. 15. 15. Come on. Somebody get me up to 20 bucks. Got 15. Make 17 and a half. Full of cards. Mike, they were some good cards in there. Jerry, we going to sell these? Mike, yeah. sell. Sell them. 
dogs, big kids, small toys. That cord right there is going to. It says ski helmet. But I told Christy, I said, that's one of them repelling helmets. But it does say ski helmet. And it's real nice, y'all. It's uh What's that say, Christy? I can't see it. I don't know. It's a name brand. And it's real nice. Too far away for me to be able to read it. It's got a liner. And it's got a liner in there. It's real nice. It's a noggin protector, Kimmers. You got that right. Pretty nice. It's a medium. I guess the kids could use it to ride their bikes, skateboards. You could use it for a repelling helmet. Just anything to keep from uh, cracking your head open. Uh, it's pretty hard. No, it's lightweight. You strap something. You can strap something on the back of it. You could use it for a bicycle helmet. Yeah. Sammy, before we leave. <coughs> no bits. No. Go ahead and pull it back. I think it's right. I, yeah, I, pull it back. What did I sell them cards for a while ago? $15. I didn't get a bid. Pull it back. Go ahead and sell you Star Wars. Oh, I got Star Wars, Venus. <laughs> Nobody needed the noggin. Somebody, uh, Jim, come in at five bucks. All right, we're going right here. We got a uh, Star Wars. You see some mini micro machines. Episode one. Episode, uh, episode yeah, episode one. Choice. Collection two, collection three, choice. Venice Brown, three dollars. Gonna get four. Why yeah. are you selling Venice Star Wars? Jerry said, hey, <laughs> Steve Matter, <laughs> micro machines. I got mm -hmm. Steve Matter in it. Five, choice. I knocked that little man out of that thing. Got six from Vanis Brown. Choice. Hey, I've got Vanis collecting this. Uh-oh, Vanis. You've got competition tonight. I got Steve Metter in at 10 bucks. I think Steve Metter's been collecting, too. He might be collecting for his grandson. Yeah, for his grandson. I've got 10 bucks. Choice. This one fell out right here. You probably shake him over in there. Steve, I hope yeah. Stephanie and them are well. I drank an energy drink, Vanis, and I'm kind of shaking today. I shouldn't have drank one of them. We're going to sell them. So, Steve Matter, 10 bucks. Steve, which one would you want, if not both? Both. Both. Thank you, Steve. Hold on, Venus. Here. I'm tripping over cords. Lord. What's this? Oh, it's okay, Venus. I got that other one. I know. You're this thing's kind of heavy. This Magnet. Have a good time. It's okay. K2SO. Ah, man. What does that say? It says Rogue One. I, I don't know. It's a magnet. 
That's what it says. Yeah, magnet. Is that a K250? Yeah. Okay. No, it's a K2SO. Okay. Yeah, so Got Don in at five bucks. Vanna says six. Got six bucks, Nathan seven. Got nine with, Don, with Steve Matter. Got nine with Steve Matter. Ten Jesus. With Ten with Don. He's a magnet. I don't know much about the Star Wars. Jerry ain't throwed me out or told me I was fired yet. With Ten with Don. I've got ten with Don. Let me thank make sure Steve Matter. Okay, thank you, Vanis well. and Steve Matter. We're selling this to Don for ten bucks. What we got here? What in the world? You're welcome, Don. I'm gonna sell these. I'm gonna sell these choice. Star Wars, Shadow of the Empire. They got cards. This oh. right here is a metal diecast collectible Star Wars. Luke Skywalker, he's metal. The one right here is metal. Comes with cards. One of them does. This one. Choice. It's die cast. Are both of them die No. Right here. Luke Skywalker is die cast. Vanish Brown, three bucks. Choice. Dash renders what his name is. Got four. Steve Matter. I like the die cast. Five, six. Mo jumped in there out of the blue. They hollering. Uh, Sandy Boardman's hollering. Wheel. Wheel of Whitney. I've got Mo in at six bucks. Steve first. She came in first on the TV screen here. DD and Anna, can I can I send my link? You can post your link once. But you have to register to You gotta register, DD plus Emma to do that. And I got my old eight dollars, Vanish Brown nine. You might need to post the information up there for them to register. Vanis Brown. I told y'all I was shaking a little bit. I drank the, got 10 from uh, Mo. I drank the energy drink and I shouldn't have done it. My wife said she was going to drink a coffee and I Vanis is out. Okay. Sold to Mo. Mo, which ones would you want for 10 bucks? Choice. This is diecast. Luke Skywalker's diecast. Oh. Both. He said to sail. I'm going to sail. Star Wars. It's just, I'm going to just sell this. I like this guy up here in the corner. How many's in there? Four, eight, nine. Nine. These down here is plastic, but I like that guy up there. They're plastic. I'm going to sell this and buy it sale. It's droids. Mo got that. I got it. Coming, What's coming. this? Droid Destructions, what it says. I got four with Steve Matters. She got both of them. Yes. Sorry, I was flipping. Yeah, she 
Got four with Steve Matters. What does it say right there? It says, yeah, nine figures. Yeah. Five with Mo. I like that guy up there in the corner. I got five with Mo. Star Wars. Droid Destruction. Six with Steve and Mo is out. Amy wants to know what are their names. I don't, they don't have names. Yes. Are they all droids? Yeah, they're droids. This one up here in the top is General Grievous. That's General Grievous. <laughs> That's it. The rest of them's just droids. We're going to sell it. $6 to Steve Matters. Sold. We're going to stick with the Star Wars for a second. This is uh, Star Wars Stormtrooper Art Kit. Art Kit. Look at there. Color and crayons, pencils. No, it's just markers and pencils. Maybe have some color and crayons in there. I'm not for sure. And it's got it's got different pictures. Jerry, quit. <laughs> it's got pictures you can color in there. And I got a four dollar bid from Amy. Uh, from Margaret. Five from Margaret. Barbara Grace. Yes, that's Margaret. You know. Margaret, you want to color some Star Wars? Got six. Six with Don. Margaret in it seven. Seven bucks with Barbara. Got eight with Mo. Uh, give me just a second, Amy. We'll see. This is pretty neat. Do you have more of those? It's got 45 pieces. That's the only one. That's the only one. That's the only one we have. It's got 45 Amy. pieces. Let me count this. We're at nine with Barbara. We have to have 10 or more. I think it's got 10 things you can color. I've got $9 with Barbara Graves. Mo's out. Thank you for bidding, Mo. We got 10 yeah. with Steve Matter. Got 10. Steve Matter. We didn't. It's on the top of the box. Yeah, I counted them on the back. The pictures just by itself. And it, I think it's 10, 9 or 10 pictures. You can color different ones. Everybody out? Is Amy Dorito out? Margaret, Barbara Graves is out. Steve, I'm selling them. So these for $10 to Steve Matters, and he said to send them to Dr. Amy. Guess what? Penny, Steve. And that was a good thing you done there, buddy. Amy Dorito, yes. We only had the one package, correct? Send that to Dr. Amy. Phil, it's time. German's time. Oh, Lord, Jerry. Lutzenberg. What? You said it's a Lutzenberg? What does that say on there? Handmade malt. It's German, handmade. The bottom, I think, says Lutzenberg. 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 Where do you think the bottom is? Show it to me. I don't see Lutzenberg out here. The bottom. I ain't looking at the bottom. What does it say? It says hand, I think it says hand malt is what it says. Okay. And it says German, it says something German. It's got no Roman numerals on it. We got $10 with Eric Bushman. Thank you for that, Eric. Got milk. 
It's nice. I've got 10 sandy board, but it's nice. It's got like a pewter. I guess that it might be aluminum. It's kind of heavy though right there. The lid is. It's made really good. I got 10 bucks from Sandy Boardman. That's the real deal. You know, that's the real deal. I think it is. A, it's a good one. It's from Germany. It's German. If people was to look their names up, their last name, they could have that picture in their last name if they're Speaking Irish or German. Make sure it gets in the package for Dr. Amy. It will. I'll put it over in a minute, Steve. I'll put her name on it. Got 10 bucks with Sandy Boardman. Need 12 and a half. It's German. It is German. Got 12 and a half, Eric Bushman. It's German. It's not cracked anywhere. No chips. 15 with Sandy Boardman. 15 with Sandy Boardman. It's really nice. Look at that glazing inside there. Got 17 and a half with Eric Bushman. They holler and they want the wheel. Sandy Boardman. Twenty with Sandy Boardman. Can I get twenty two and a half for this beautiful German Stein? It's stamped. I think I got twenty two fifty with Kathy Grant. Yep. Eric Bushman, twenty two and a half. Guess what? Twenty five with Sandy. Twenty five with Sandy Boardman. Surely it's worth twenty seven fifty. Probably worth a lot more. Somebody put twenty seven fifty in there. I won't sell it. Twenty seven fifty. I'm gonna sell it. Come on, Eric. It's just two dollars, and I, oh well, it's only five more bucks. And I'll sell it. Twenty-seven fifty, and I'm gonna sell it. Come on, y'all. Drop it. Go. Oh. Twenty-five. I was trying to make Jerry proud of me. <laughs> What's this, Jerry? It's a bed pillow. A bed pillar. I'm sorry, Eric. I think I think Eric's lagging a little bit. He said this is a bed pillar, and I'm going to open it. It's some type of pillar. I will put it back in here. When I, if I get it out, it's round. It's round, and it's real. It's like a memory foam. It's like memory foam. It's memory foam. It unzips where you can clean it, wash it. I guess it's for your neck. I think it would be. They said bolster, whatever that is. How, hey, what if you stuck it under your head like this, off the couch? <laughs> My neck would be sore. Is it worth two fifty? I got a two fifty bed. You got five with Debbie Wicks. Got five. Yes, it'd be good to lay under your head if you're on the couch or something. 
That's what I'd use it for. Prop your knee up or something. Give it a little elevation. Can I get six bucks? I got Debbie Wicks in it. Five. Twyla's out. Thank you for being Twyla. Well, Twyla and Brian Plo, are you out, Brian Plo? We got six with Don. Got six with Don. He jumps in there. Can I get seven? You got seven with Kathy. Got seven with Kathy. Kathy Grant come in. Brian says he's out. Thank Brian's you. out. I got Kathy in first at seven dollars. That's Kathy Grant, Debbie. I need eight. If not, let me know if you're out, and we'll move right on along. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for that eight dollar bid. It's a nice little pillar. You can take the cover off and wash it. Surely this thing is not the home shopping network. <laughs> I got eight dollars. Can I get nine? That's Surely. I know it was at least worth ten bucks. At least ten dollars. If we got eighty-seven people on here and I got ten dollars. Can I get 12 and a half? I'm going to put it back in here. Got 12 and a half. I'm going to put it back in here. We're going to take care of it. I'm going to roll it up. Got 15. With Kathy Grant. It's, it's got its own box right here. It's brand new. Guess what, Kathy Grant? It's yours. What in the world? What in the world? What is he trying to get me to sell? Don't open it. It's sealed. It's sealed. Original. Teriyaki. What is that? Teriyaki. Seaweed. Roasted seaweed. Seasoned roasted seaweed. Yamamoto. Yama something. He got some kind of, I don't know about this, y'all. It looks like, y'all don't want to know what it looks like. He said it's seaweed. Y'all know anything about seaweed? Oh, close, close up. I think they make tea and stuff out of it. Are you joking, man? No. I, you don't want, I was going to open it. No, this don't open it. Because I thought, what in the world is, look at that stuff. Yes. I got a $3 bid from Kathy Grant. She knows what it is. It says original. Let me see what it says. It don't say much. Jeff Reynolds said smoke it. It's seaweed. Bubba's Corner said you eat it. I wouldn't eat it. Maybe he said it's usually wrapped around sushi. Kathy Grant's three dollars. Yes, it is, Mo. It's a China import, yeah. No, they didn't make it's it got, in China. It's got Chinese writing. Somebody dove for that. It does, <laughs> Mildred. It does have Chinese writing on it. Yes, it does. Somebody dove for that notion, got it out. Debbie Weeks is at two and a half. I, no, I've got Kathy Grant, three dollars. Okay. She jumped in there at three dollars. She knows what it was. said don't eat it. I would never open it. They're wanting you to open and eat it, Ricky. You give me twenty dollars. You give me twenty dollars, I will open that and I will take a bite of it. I don't even know. I don't, twenty dollars. What are you supposed to do with it? I'll I'll take a bite of it. What do you do with it? I don't know. <laughs> Bubba's Corner said twenty dollars. Are you ser are you are you serious? Are you serious? All right, we got six. I'm gonna open it. I hey, got it's a snack. Wait a minute, they got I told them twenty dollars. I would take a bite out of it and eat it. All right, you wait a minute. You got uh, Sandra and and uh, Bubba's Corner in. It's a 
Open it up, Brad. Kathy Grant said 22 and a half. For me to eat it? She just said 22 and a half. I'll take a bite of it and eat it. I think she's buying to keep it, not for you to eat it. Hey, I'll tell you what, uh, Kathy Grant has got to pay 22 and a half, and I'll give her a fresh bottle, and then we'll, we'll, uh, she's paying 22 half to get Ricky to eat some of it. No, she, she wants, wants it. it. I'll take a bite of it for 20, y'all. Kathy Grant's wanting to buy Seaweed. Right, oh, Kathy yeah, Grant's. I was going to try that. Ricky's going to try it. I was. That's what I brought it up here for. Uh, Ricky, uh, here's what we'll do. We'll make uh, Where's since my Bubba Corner. Hey, since Bubba Corner did the $20 first, we're going to make him pay the 20 and we'll send him a bottle of it, and then we'll sell it at $10. I was going to eat. I was you, got gonna, it, you got to at $20. That's what you got more there. of it. Yeah, we got six bo bottles of it yeah, back I was there. Try it. All right. Jay Moon said that it's delicious. I'm going to fix and tell you. I'm going to be like, man, it stinks. <laughs> and I'm going to get ready to spin the wheel. It go. stinks. Said it's really, really. Where's my drink at? Flavor. <laughs> it stinks. He said, Billis, y'all eat it. I No, ain't no y'all. Oh, my God. No, you it smells us. like. Seaweed. Man, I'm going to. Let Wait a minute. Smell it. Oh, God, it smells like rotten fish or something. It's even hey, somebody get the hey, hey, it does. It smells, it smells like, like fish. It smells like high knee. Yeah, it smells like fish. <laughs> it smells like sardines. It, smells it like does, sardines. like sardines. Yeah. Somebody screenshot the face he makes when he eats Look, it. Look, here's one face. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me see it. <laughs> Let me see it. Look, it's green. <laughs> Look, I'm going to fold it up. Here it goes. Now you got to eat it. Now you got to chew it. What's it taste like? Sardines. <laughs> it's like sardines. Is it good? It ain't bad. You want to eat another? I can. It's healthy snacks. It's healthy. healthy. Yeah. You want to eat one? For twenty dollars. <laughs> Is it that good? Are you fooling me? You like sardines? Not really. Oh, I got you. Don't let it soak on Mother's your tongue first. It's your turn, Jerry. No, take it all in. Just take it all in. Let it soak on your tongue. <laughs> oh, give me some drink. Does it taste like sardines? But the texture of it, I'm not going to lie. It's like a piece of paper. Give me some drink. I'm not joking you. It's like a piece of paper with sardines. Like That's like John T. Lucky late. Sardines on a piece of paper and cut it out, and just let it sit there for a long time. Hey, and then said you still have to pour the body outside. <laughs> you don't reckon that wouldn't be worth twenty dollars? <laughs> Jerry couldn't hack it. I don't like sardines. I'm just trying to get. I it don't like sushi. Where I can swallow it. And I sure the heck don't like seaweed. Israel <laughs> said twenty dollars is twenty dollars, right? <laughs> no. Ricky was making out like it was delicious, and I'm it was, hungry. It's anyway. pretty good. All right, we got five. Uh, we got five bottles left. <laughs> Kathy Grant, we're gonna pass it I at can't ten dollars. I've done that. I'm fixing. It does taste so like. Up. It tastes like. Here, you can have the rest of that one. <laughs> I don't want to hear you say I'm sick. It tastes like it does. <laughs> Sardines on paper. Ten dollars, Kathy Grant. How many did you want of them? <laughs> It's like sardines. Uh, on we a got paper. we got five left. Bill Bubba twenty dollars. But it kind of when you let it dissolve, it's got a little salty flavor. Jay said, "Go over and give Christy a kiss." <laughs> no, she ain't gonna kiss me. If you like sardines <laughs> and stuff, I guess I'm really swallowing it. Uh, Kathy Grant gets one, but I am gonna take a drink of this. <laughs> hey Jerry, did I do good? You did good. <laughs> I'm thinking so up. It's bad, ain't it? And make them want to quit smoking. You don't want to eat a lot of it. I'm telling you what. How's it feel to be green, Jerry? I don't know, but sweat's popping out on my forehead. It's the thought Lotus of it. Corner said it was worth the money. <laughs> it's the thought of it, ain't it? It is like sardines, ain't it? Like papery sardines. <laughs> That's worse than the cat hair unit. Oh, God. No, no, Anybody else want some of this delicious... Uh, Teriyaki nori seasoned roasted seaweed. I tasted it. Y'all seen it. Some people might like it. I swallowed it on YouTube. 
Well, you, we sold one of them, and then this and here's your gift, Ricky. Anybody else want to point at ten dollars? We'll pass them. Hey, Sammy Hudgens, you want to try it? <laughs> let's do a. I'll uh, say let's spin Sammy the wheel, guys. It. I'll try to sell something while we're spinning the wheel. It could uh, be like a dog Bubba, fish. Yeah, I've never tasted go fish food, Sammy but it could be. To try it. I left it here for we you. We left it here it. for you, Sammy. I'm not kidding. I'm fixing to throw so, up. Hey, Sammy will do it. He was a Marine. Where's the other? <laughs> All right, raise your cotton picking sites, guys. I told y'all we're going to the, – the auction – Mildred. I, I don't know what if they had offered me 20, knowing what it tastes like right now, to, to done eat it, some more you? of it, to eat a whole bar, just done it I, I wouldn't do it for a $100 bill. He done it because I did it. I wouldn't eat another, another strip of that and swallow that for a $100 oh, bill. Man. Uh, but anyway, raise your sights. We'll put it in the, the Samaritan boxes, but then they'll probably come and burn my Samaritan boxes down after they try it. <laughs> you know, we, we've got a few of them that'll try to clear out the whole Samaritan box when we put stuff in there. Oh, God, put one in there. We can put them in there. They won't they, ever come back to the Samaritan they box. They grab it. Oh, my oh. God. They said their nephew loves it. I mean, some people buy it. I mean, it I just, is. It, it tastes like. Anyway, sardines. guys, this is a uh, Don. You was talking about depression glass the other night. This is depression glass. That's no Vaseline. chips or anything. Beautiful Vaseline. It this, is. Andy, you got the light to make this glow in the dark. The black light. The black light. It's pretty. Yeah. But these glow in the dark because oh, they she's had. Got one. She's coming. They had uranium in them, guys. They, they had uranium in them. It's pretty. And uh, they glow in the dark when you I put them under a, a black light. I bought a oh. depression glass. And I bought Beautiful piece here. Pretty. Vaseline. Now, this is the kind of glassware that never goes down in value. I feel funny. It, all, it always stays the same. You get sick, you just get sick. But it's a beautiful piece. You know what I feel like? I've eaten something from China. I feel, the like, ocean. <laughs> I feel like, uh, you know, I used to work in a tobacco and I'd get nicotine sick. The first time you worked in it, it'd all go in your skin. Then after that, you was good. But at the end of the day, uh, Dennis, have you ever chopped tobacco the very first time and you sweat? Get that tobacco in your I system. I got a sweaty light. Get throw up. You want the light off? And, yeah, turn the light off, Mama. Oh, he's Don't hit a, that one switch. That's black light. We're gonna, are you serious? Yeah, we'll, uh, I'll give you the dimensions, Amy. Where'd y'all get a black light flashlight? Yeah, I would throw up. I remember working with David Strode out there in Larry Dale Williams, and I got so sick. Uh, yeah, you oh, look at that. Look at that goes. Under the black light. Look at there. You can't you can't see it really wow. good. It glows. Uh, hit the uh, other switches, Mama. Don't hit the one red switch or we'll go off there. The one's on your right, all three of them. It's pretty. And I'm only at $25, That looks guys. like something Superman would be scared of. But look at that there, guys. That's the uranium in it. But later on, they quit putting uranium in the glass for obvious reasons. Got 25 and started $1. putting magnesium in them. And the magnesium ones will glow a little bit different. That dirty with Amy. But that is Vaseline glass. That's kryptonite. And if you ever see these at yard sale, that's a sure way to tell if you've got a piece of, of uh, Vaseline. Absolutely gorgeous, guys. Dirty with Amy. Okay. And you can get a set of these. Thirty-five with Don. Uh, it's pretty. We're we're good there, and you it's can not got a crack on. You can you can get a set of them because I've got, uh, the state I bought out that I'm trying to to bring in a little bit at a time. Uh, there is actually, I, may, I have actually got two of them. I guarantee to sell one of these. But you can't find these hardly anymore. I'm telling you. And I'm only That's at thirty-seven fifty. And right now, Don would be my backup bidder, but somebody might want them to sit on each uh, end, end of the coffee table or, or on each side of the mantel or something like yeah, that. That'd be pretty too. Or just put it in their cabinets. Yeah. And guys, I'm going to try to mix a little more of the estate Last items cabinet. in tonight. Uh, my neighbor, the airline pilot, his uh, mom had passed away, and he'd added some other estate items that we bought out from him, and we're trying to sell them up. Uh, 37 and a half. 40 Amy. Whoa. Whoa, 40. 40 with who? Sandy. 40 with Sandy. Sandy, and then Don. Did, did, she did came Sa in before it was dropped. She came in before it was 40, dropped. Got 44 with 
Amy Dorito. Amy Dorito, 44. And Don was in bidding, so he's actually would be the backup bidder. 50 with Sandy. We got 50 with Sandy. Don says he's out now. I got you, and I do have two of these guys. I would want them both. You I have to set that. one on each yeah. mantle or one on each it's end burning. table. Thank, out. thank you, Don. It's green. Uh, so, actually, my backup bidder now would be Amy. Amy. No, Don was back in at 42. So, I, uh, Don would actually be my backup bidder. Sold it $50, Sandy Borman. On the Vaseline glass. And that's worth that. They're probably about $75, $80. Is what they're came actually. back at 40 Oh, Amy came in at 44 Amy though. Amy yeah, I got you. Amy, Amy would be my backup bidder. I have two of these. Sandy Borman, I have two of them. Beautiful Vaseline piece. And I'm going to draw a number here, guys, so we can. Yeah, I didn't see that 44 bid. Uh, the the uh, bidder, 2394, Becky. 2394. I mean, you want Sandy Boardman. Sandy, I have two of them. And then it go back to Amy and then Don. Stephen Houchins. Stephen Houchins, you have 30 seconds to be able to spin the wheel of Whitney. You got to type in here. And Sandy Borman, uh, did, I don't know if she fainted she or fainted. what she did. But we have two of those exactly in the same shape. Yeah, this Vaseline stuff is it's pretty expensive when you go to buy it. I wonder if her cable would go over. Uh, so Houchins is not here. Let's call another, uh, another name. She may have been bidding on something else, too. I She's don't know. on that pain medicine tonight, Jerry. <laughs> where she had surgery. She had surgery, oh, sure enough. Where she that. had surgery, 945. I'm Becky, 945. Sandy gets... Ricky Long. Ricky's husband. Ricky, Ricky Long. Ricky or Vicky Long. Where's You've got 30 one, seconds Jerry? to tell us if you're here or not. And go ahead and give me the chips for the, the items. Where's the other one? At? Uh, it's upstairs. I'm going to put this over on okay. the field. Yeah, Sandy just had surgery. You might want to message her and make sure she knows what she's doing. I'm not supposed to actually sell anything to somebody drunk and somebody just had surgery that's on pain medicine. <laughs> now, truthfully, if you're an auctioneer and you see somebody come to your auction, and of course on here I can't tell. If you see somebody come to your auction and they're bidding crazy and stuff, as an auctioneer, you're supposed to, you know, unless you know the person and they drink all the time, then it's fine. But if, if they get too loaded, uh, you're supposed to go back and uh, remind them. Uh, item number 46. Item number 46. Man, I'm belching that stuff. It tastes just no, like. Cameras, no jewelry. It tastes just like. No, no, no you didn't miss no jewelry, hun. Item 46. That person ought to be here. Davis says she's in yeah, uh, we're supposed to as an auctioneer. We can actually lose our license if uh, they come back later and say, man, I was drunk. You sold me a $10,000. Uh, Becky, who is who is 2310 when you get a chance there? We got Sandy in for both of them. We just want to make sure she ain't. Out there in La La Land. And I'm aggravating Sandra. I hope she's doing well after her surgery. But I know after I had my kidney stone surgery, they had me. I was loopy. Yeah. Some uh, people can't they handle it different. Uh, 2310. And I don't know. Is Tammy, Blankenship. Tammy Blankenship. Tammy Blankenship, you have 30 seconds. What's she buy? She was the number. Don won the Star Wars. Oh, Don. Don. Okay, Don's got to be here. And Don has to say here. And Tammy Blankenship, you're the just a registered bidder. Yep. And Don Tammy has to here. say here. Yeah. Tammy and Don. Come on, Don. And Don won the Star Wars item, so he gets. Don's here. Don bought the Star Wars item, so he's good to go. Don's here. They both. Here. Don, do you want fifteen dollars in Uncle Chad bucks, or do you want to spend the wheel 
of Whitney. Tammy, Tammy's got the same choice, too. And Tammy will have the same choice. Don's going to take the $15. Let's see what Don would have won. Don, does he know there's more money up there on there? Yeah, he's, he's, he's watched it too many nights here. Don, this is what you would have won. Oh, and he, he made the right. right choice. Yeah, he did that right. All right, Tammy. She said All right, Tammy, good luck. I'm good taking luck, the $15 Tammy. back away from you. And here we go, Tammy. Big spin of the wheel. Come on. Uh, and she lost $5, $5, lost $5. $10, but that's okay. You, you buy some more items, Tammy. Well, she got actually got her name drawn without buying an item because she's just being registered. Good deal right there. Kimmers, they liable to draw you out one, one of these days. Your name's All right. there. Let's get back on it. I'm going to put uh, – Mama, have we got any type jewelry that we're going to sell tonight? I'll let her do that sometime after the uh, 9.30, 9.30 time. Uh, hey, Mama, do you want to uh, – Ricky, go ahead and sell – Ricky, go ahead and sell this for me. And guys, we'll have another draw. You here in a is a mystery box? No, it's I, don't, I think it's a lighty picture. Let them see that. It's a light picture. <laughs> what is it? Don't don't take it out. What do you got? I got a light picture. Got a light picture. Okay. Well. Let's see what this. Uh, oh, that Ricky sell it. Oh, it's good. It's got uh, globes in it. Ricky, this is what you're selling next. Don't think I won't. You give it here. No. I'll sell it right on your no. option. Don't dare me. No. <laughs> lonely, not lonely no more. <laughs> Because I'll sell you a three. <laughs> Family show. Family show. Family show. Family show. <laughs> I'm going to show y'all the globes to it. They're not broke. Hey, They're clear round yeah, glass. Yeah, the yeah, I'm, I'm getting it in Here's what the globes look like to the light fixture. They're both in good shape. Both of those are not broken. They're in good shape. And I'm going to keep them that way. I'm going to set that down here and I'm going to wrap this. It looks sort of, it looks brass. Nobody's bid on this, but they ain't seen it either. I think this would look good outside on a porch. It's like that right there. Got five. The globes are good. Neither one of them are blow, broke and they're clear. It's got the whole mountain kit in here. You can put it on the porch over your bathroom sink. Maximum wattage mo is 60 watt. 60 watt each bowl. And I got a five dollar bid needing. Got ten. No. What? You're yeah. welcome, Mo. She won ten dollars. But I got five on this. Anybody give me six? A nice wall fixture. Put it over the sink. It look real good. Got everything here to do it with. Penny's but, good to bid now, Kimmers. But the husband to put it up for you. Look good over the bathroom sink. And I got six. 
Got six. Can I get seven? Got seven. Can I get eight? Nice. It looked good. It sticks out about five inches from the wall. From the wall, probably six with the wall kit. Got eight with Danny Vance. Got two, two nice globes. You just take unscrew these and screw the globes right up, right up there. That's what he was Probably meant to put ten. Probably. Ten with Jack. Got ten with Jack Thurman. He's bidding against it. No, he ain't. I got ten with Jack Thurman. And I, with got twelve and a half with Mo. A nice light fixture. It's never been used. Nothing like that. Got twelve and a half. I'm going to put it back in the bag. Got all the hardware to put it together with right there. All but the tools. Oh, they have broke something over there. <laughs> or something just fell off. I got 12 and a half. I'm going to put it back down in here. Danny's I've got, out. Jack Thurman's out. Sell it to Mo. Sold the Mo for 12 and a half. I think I need help. I got it here. This in there. It. What did he say he wanted me to sell? Oh, what's that? <laughs> what? He's got me on light fixtures. No, it's a plant stand up there. It's a plant stand. Well, you use it for what is that? Thank you very much. That's what it said. It's got everything in there. It's a... It's a plant. I guess it's a plant stand or... I don't know. It's a stand of some kind. It's metal. It's gold. You could use it for a cake stand. Set a pie down in it. Put fruit in it. I've just got it setting up here. It ain't put together, but. It's It's about a foot wide. When Jerry comes back, Steve, we'll, we'll tell him. Anybody? Maybe not. No beds. I know I ain't. Uh, just being five on it. Got five. We are, what, well, $5 right now on the cake stand. Got five. Is everybody lagging? Seven with Penny Coker. Seven with Penny Coker. Comes with the tools and everything to put it together. It's a cake stand. It's a cake stand. Look, I even had it put together wrong. We got 10 for Abby Connor. It's a cake stand. It goes like this. It goes like that. It's a cake stand. I don't know. I just looked at the instructions. It's Twelve and a half is mold. It goes like that. It's a cake stand. I didn't know what it was. It's a cake stand. That's exactly what it is. It's gold. It is a cake stand. It goes just like that. I got 12 and a half with Mo. It's nice. It's painted gold. It's okay, 12 and a half going once. 12 and a half going once. Eight fifteen. 15. Going back in the box. I know, Gil. I guess we're lagging. I think it we're lagging. Connie, Abby is ready for 
Is that all the beds? I got 12 and a half. So, my You pay it, cameras. All right. This is some exercise equipment right here. Fit Index Resistance Trainer. Making health easier. Oh, Lord. I don't know what you do with stuff. Look, he gives me the hard stuff. What do you hook it to? A bench or something? What would you hook this to? A wall or something? What come with it? Oh, it's got all this stuff. It's got these. Gail. What? Gail. It's got these, uh, you know, when you go to the chiropractor and they give it. Or you have therapy, they give you these cord, these rubber things to pull on, medium, light. It's got those in there. What would you use that for? You put this in your mouth and see how far you pull, I guess. Bite on it. Yeah, resistance. <laughs> I don't know what this is for. No, it's got instructions. Uh, bondage. Bondage. What's that? What <laughs> you put your oh, I'm gonna show them. You hook this to something. You can do push ups. You can pull yourself up. You does some, I don't. You does everything. I don't know how you do all that stretching stuff. I'm too fat for stretches. Got all this you can do with it, but you got to hook it to a pole or something. You're right, Joey. Any bitters, Christy? I haven't seen anything yet. It's an exercise thing. It's for stretches. Five dollars per dollar. Five bucks. Steve Bader said more uh, estate stuff, please, Jerry. Coming right up. That's something for your head. Six with Mo. There's something for your head to pull with on your head. That goes with that light. Yeah, I got to put that in there. All right, guys. Got all need... this. You can adjust it. It shows you adjustments on it. Pretty nice outfit, and I got $6 with Mo. She's up there first on the Lord, Terry. Seven with Donald. Seven with Resistance trainer. Yes, resistance trainer. I don't know how you'd use it myself. I ain't into stretching. That goes in there. No. Look here at that nice beehive jug. Oh. And I guess that was a flaw in the, uh, when they did the air. Uh, I got eight with Mo. We fix and sell it. Oh. Ten with Don. That is nice. Twelve and a half with Mildred. I sort of like that strip. Been down. Twelve and a half with Mildred. That, I sort of like that. You're going to have to take this box. He gives it character. Twelve and a half with Don's out. Twelve and a half with Don. All right. Raise your cotton picking sights here, guys. I did go up and get some more of my state items while I was up there. I looked at a few of the booths and I bought a few items. And if I do good on them, I do good on them. If not, I help move the, the dealer stuff. But this is one of those items. That stuff was so bad. Christy. But this is a beehive guy. And look, it's only got very few, and you can't find many of them that don't, very few uh, little chips right around that. And this right here, I don't know if this was like painted at one time and they cleaned the paint off of it because you can't, this glaze, you can't do anything with it. You can't remove it. And they left some of this paint on there. See what I'm talking about? Or, because I'm scratching across that and that may just be where they didn't clean that paint all the way off there. Or it was in the uh, mold when they done it. But I think it gives it character. I like that. 
But anyway, here we go. We're only at fifteen dollars on the Beehive jug, and it's in great shape. Put a corn cob in the top, top of it. Yeah, that is beautiful. Cut it isn't off it? a little bit. I like the shape of that jug. See, the, I think they call that the Beehive. And like I said, I don't know if that's a paint that was on it. It's not. It's not. I don't, it's not in the glaze. So you probably get paint thinner and, and take that off. Any maker's mark on it. Uh, no, there's no maker marks. It is a gallon beehive jug. Is it where I'm only at fifteen dollars and stuck it against the wall? Uh, you don't. I wouldn't scrape it off. I believe somebody's painted. I wouldn't scrape it off, but it looks like this. And and people used to paint these jugs for whatever reason. And I think whoever the the booth dealer up here, they cleaned this and they didn't get this clean because I can take my fingernail across there and. Uh, Almost scratch that off, so you put paint thinner on. I like it like that. I like the character; it just makes it look different. And I'm only at fifteen dollars. Yeah, they might have done that to tell what was in it. It's not marked. It is not not marked, and most most of these jugs are not marked. No, period. Unless you find the 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 uh, gray ones that you know that's got the blue. Uh, one gallon or whatever like yeah. that on there. But it's a great item right it's here. Like a whiskey Beehive. And, really? uh, I'd value that around $50 or better at least. And we're only at 20 True. bucks. We're only at $20. I don't think I've ever sold a Beehive that cheap. That's that's why I ain't putting a lot of the estate items up tonight, Steve. I seen that when I was getting out of the out of my place up there. I've got a few of those items, a spittoon and, and a little That's creamer right. and a little creamer and things like that. I seen that and I thought, well, I'll help the dealer out a little bit. And uh, that's what basically all I'm going to be doing. I'm at 30 with Virginia. And, and it's a nice one. It helped my dealers out a little bit. I got one more item that I picked out. Thirty-two and a half. Uh, how much to ship to a nine-eight to California? Well, if you buy other stuff, cameras, we can mix it in. We'll actually put that in a separate box and put it out in a bigger box. That's what we'll be trying to do. We got thirty-five with West, West Mitchell, Virginia first, and it is a nice one. Oh, that's Washington. Yeah, and I always used, uh, uh, I think it was uh, the gel that you get at any lumber company. We're at 37 and a half. We're probably talking 50, you know, 60. I don't know. I've not priced a beehives in a long time. I've not had one of the beehives. I just saw that up there and picked it. We're at 37 and a half with Sandy Borman. We need a $40 bill, guys. Surely it's worth 40 bucks. Got it. Got 40. That looks good. And the bidding's going copy. really slow, guys. It's taking me way too long. What a hoop I got it. I'm going I'm to go ahead and sell it for $40, Virginia. The, the bidding's just coming in too slow, guys. I'm an auctioneer. I got to move these things along. Thanks for bidding, Sandy and uh, uh, William Thomason. This is another one I picked out of one of the booths up there. A beautiful butter mold. I mean, this is a nice butter mold right here. Oh, it is. Look at the design on that. Absolutely gorgeous. And this is the only two items I picked out and bought because I'm not that big of a gambler. Uh, but it, like I said, it will help the booth dealers a little bit. And really nice butter mold. It's not had any stain or anything put on there like that. It is a nice one. Look at there, Tad. Got uh, Dennis Harper in at $20. Uh, very nice. And, guys, these, I, the reason I pick a few items like that and I go ahead and buy them and pay for them is because I want you to know what kind of dealers we've got up there. They have some really good stuff. I'm surprised more people in Scottsboro are coming in up there. Well, we're get, we're getting it built up more and more. Am I like twenty dollars, guys? Nice butter mold. Twenty dollar bid. Would you go twenty two and a half? 
twenty dollar bill, you go twenty two and a half. Super nice. Dennis likes. It's nice. You got a nice little creamer coming up next out of the the estate sale that Steve Metter was talking about, and a nice heavy duty spit tune coming up here in just a second. We're at twenty, looking for twenty two and a half, and we got to go. Twenty dollar bill, you go twenty two and a half. Twenty dollar bill, you go twenty two and a half, going once. $20 bid, would you go 22 and a half going twice? I got a $20 bid, and y'all are wrong on this. Is so this crazy. is the third and final call on the wooden butter mold. Dennis Harper has scared everybody all to death. 20 bucks. $20. 20. <laughs> I got 22 and a half, and a half Kimmers. from Kimmers. And Kimmers live up in, a, she lives up in a Washington? Yep. Oh, good deal. We're at 22 and a half, guys. She came in the, the got twenty five down to the mountains. She got uh, Kimmer, yeah. Okay, she good deal. Way. We've got them in about every 25. state, and uh, we sort of, you know, I like that because we can sort of find out what's going on in different states. You know, weather and uh, different things that's going on, and uh, we enjoy having people. Because uh, I'm probably never going to travel to Washington because I'd have to fly, and I ain't flying nowhere. God wanted us to fly. Be, he would have made us all supermen and let us flow. <laughs> all right, 25 with Dennis. Uh, Kimber, let me know if you're out. I need 27 and a half. Got I gonna, got 27 and a half. I'm now 30. My wings in heaven, Jerry. But, Ricky, uh, these uh, next items, this is a nice little creamer right here. Uh, it's a USA creamer. Uh, excellent shape. We'll let you sell them while I grab some more state items, and we'll have some more of the newer items here in a little bit to finish up the auction. Dennis Harper is out. So Thank you, Ben. So, Kimmer, yeah. come by right there. Dennis, that's going to Washington. All right, now this is some of the more of the state stuff, and, and that's two items uh, that you'll find up in the antique mall. And uh, we bought them a while ago, like I said, to sort of show you. I've seen them, and I liked them. So uh, that helps our dealer out, and it helped me out a little bit. I still got to deal with like paying for packaging and stuff. So did I make any money? I think I made a little bit there. All right, look at this creamer. This came out of that estate, and look at the drip down through there, Ricky. Yeah. See that glaze? Yeah. Where it's where they it just ran down through there. That's got a nice drip on it there, all the way around there. I like that. That gives it character right there. Uh, there's no the bottom of it. No chips or nothing. Beautiful little creamer. Tell them the size on it. And uh, somebody asked me the size of something while ago, and I forgot to measure it. What was the measure? Right here. The oh, the Vaseline. Amy, I'm uh, sorry. I didn't get a measurement for you. This, this is five, five inches. inches. Five inches. And we'll pull that a little closer. It's five inches. It's a nice little creamer, creamer guys. And then Ricky sells the, the brass fit, nice. too. And that is that is a really nice. Uh, that's an older one, too. You know it? Yeah. That ain't, that ain't one of them repops. You've got the weight on the bottom of it. Somebody get me started. Glazed real good. It's pretty. It is pretty. No chips. No chips. No word. Where you at? And I got ten dollars right off the bat from William Thomason. Real pretty. But I'm not back. I'll, I'll set you. <laughs> When you sell a spit tune if I'm not back, do you sell choice on those okay. nice, really nice cars? Okay. 15, Gail Fowler. It's five inches tall. That's a that's about the nice. It ain't got thing. no cracks, nothing. It's a good one. And I've got fifteen dollars. Need seventeen and a half. Got seventeen and a half. Can I get twenty? It is pretty. Got 17 and a half with William Thomason. Making 20. Bill wants to know what's on the bottom. Uh, USA and RPCO. USA RRR Company. No RRP Company. I think that's a, a Roseville Pottery, maybe. RRP. I think they made that in a, a Roseville, Ricky. Roseville? I think so. I don't know. He thinks it's Roseville. 
Pottery. Really? I don't know for sure. That's the name of a city, I think, in Ohio. Yeah, we just spun the wheel while ago. It's pretty. Guess what? William, you was the only one and Gail bidding on this. 17 and a half. So the William Thomason. Go oh Lord. Spit tone. Union Pacific Railroad. Somebody really spit in that. <laughs> I don't know. It's a spit tone. Yeah, we spun a while ago. Got 10. With Wes Mitchell. Gonna get 1250 for a spit tone. Got 20 with other scorner. Got 15. Got 20. 25 Pacific or Union Pacific Railroad. 25 with Wes and Virginia. 25 with Wes and Virginia. Got 25. Spit tone. Union Pacific Railroad. 30 with Don. 30 with Don. Virginia's at 40. Got Virginia with 40. I believe this company right here run over my daddy. His daddy really did I'm, get I'm hit. I'm not lying to you. His daddy yeah. really got hit by a train. Run over my uncle and him coming home from work up there in Indiana, Union Pacific. 45 with, or excuse me, 50 with Virginia. Took him down the track. Got 45, got 50. Bubba's corner is out. Thank you for bidding. Union Pacific. I won't never forget it. I was a little kid then. They had to put pins in his leg. They do plastic surgery on his face. Then I got fifty dollars. What's it go after fifty? Fifty-five. Fifty-five. Can I get fifty-five? Brass. I think it's brass. I'm pretty Everybody's sure. Everybody's out. Yeah. Sell it. Hey, Mitchell. West Mitchell, 50 bucks. That's the truth. All right. He said choice on these Hot Wheels. I guess one picked McDonald's. Got these Hot Wheels. Four of them. Choice. Choice. One of them's McDonald's. There's no 55 pink on the bottom. I could never figure out growing up as a kid why they'd make race cars out of them 55 Chevrolets. And now you can't find them no more. And they worth 30 something thousand dollars when you find one. Fixed up. Or more. Five Got five dollars. We're done. Choice. Got five dollars needing six. We with, got six. Got six with Mo. Gonna get seven. Got it. Who's it with? Don. Got seven with Don. Thank you, Christy. Gonna get eight dollars. Choice. Got it with Mo. $8 with Mo. Can I get nine? Got 10 with Don. Got 10 with Don. Guys, we're going to try the cobbler's bench that we have up there. Can I get 12 and a half? And I think we'll be able to ship that. Mo's out. Don. So, y'all was the only two bidding? Yep. Back Which up ones there. do you want, Don? Which one do you want? If not all. He wants to follow four times. Thank you, Don. All right, Ricky's going to go get that cobbler's bench for me. Uh, guys, we're going to try it. It's, it. It makes a beautiful coffee table. And uh, Ricky, be careful. It's got a drawer in it that'll fall out on you. 
if you're not careful, that slid Is underneath. That why you're standing me up there? And it's right there when you walk down the aisle. We're going to try that. It's a beautiful piece that came from that estate. Guys, y'all know what this is, don't you? Acme Ice Cream Maker. I think that's what it says on it. And it's all in pretty decent shape. But you're talking about a nice piece to maybe put some ceiling on it and put it up on your cabinet or something. Old ice cream maker, guys. They would put the, uh, what is it, the, the salt and the ice down in here. And they would turn that and put the cream down in there. It tells how to do it even on there, too. Use only ice cream salt. But that is nice. And it's still got, like I said, the Acme freezer. And it looks like Philadelphia, Pennsylvania had a patent number on it. So y'all sit around wherever you want to. Uh, bring it over here, Ricky, if you can get got room. I'm going to sell one other thing, and then we're going to try to move that. And, guys, I think we can ship it. We'll just have to put it in a long box, and we can buy the other items around it. A beautiful piece right here, guys. It's got a drawer. You want me to pull it out a little bit? Drawer. Yeah, 15 with Sammy Huggins, 20 with Sandy Boardman. Great item right here, guys. Y'all see the cobbler's bench that we've got? Absolutely gorgeous. And like I said, we will have to put a, a, a reserve on that, and we can seldom do that, but I think it'll make the reserve. It is a nice item. It came out of that estate. 22 and a half with Sammy Huggins. What? 25 with Sandy Boardman. Need 27 and a half. On the old timey ice cream maker. Now I gotta go. Sammy, are you in or out? 27 and a half with Sammy. And we're gonna have our drawing again here in just a minute, guys. 30 with Sandy Borman. We got any of that drink left? Any any drink left over in the fridge? I'll check. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, Sandy Borman going in out of here. Thirty dollars. What am I spit to him, right? How much? Yeah, that was a nice one. All right, guys. Ricky's getting me some tea, and I'm going to sell this cobbler's bench. I'm going to try to. It is a beautiful piece, guys. Let me see if I can get it up here on this table. You talking about making a great coffee table. And we are... Gonna put it, it's not going to fit on the table. But I'll try to show it to you guys. This is a great piece right here. And the cobbler would put their nails and everything in here. They would work on the shoes right out here. This is the real deal. Let me see which way that slides out so I can show you the top of it. Look at this piece, guys. Came out of that state that we bought from our neighbor. It's pegged up through here. It's got a sliding drawer over here, and we, we can just sort of roll this around a little bit to show y'all a little bit more of it. Look at my box here, Ricky. Just a great, great item right there, and we it's not that heavy, so we will be able to ship it. We'll just put it in a long box. Let me have my tape measure here. We'll, we'll put it in a box and put your other items that you win if you win any more around it. Uh, it's 40 inches long and uh, 17 inches wide. 
And guys, this thing would set up, make a perfect coffee table when you're talking about a conversation piece. And I do have a reserve on it. I do have a reserve on it. It's a nice piece that I brought in up there. You know, Mo, it, it's, it's really not Morning, that, not that heavy. Uh, Morning, Dennis Harvey. And my reserve won't be as high. This is worth quite a bit. And you see the uh, drawer here. You can put your remote controls in that. And you don't have to use it for that. It could be just, I'll give you the height. Ricky, give me the height from there to there. And the drawer, the only thing I see, there's a little bitty split right here in that drawer. If y'all can see that. Slides right in there. <clears throat> Absolutely gorgeous How tall piece. is it? Yeah, I gave him the other measurements. A little over 15. A little over 15 inches, guys. You talking about a nice, nice piece. There you go. Look at that. We ain't even cleaned it off. I mean, you put that down as a coffee table. Like I said, you're talking about a conversation piece. Got 35. Look at the character on the guys. And I don't think we're going to meet a reserve. 40. 50. Got yeah, 50 in uh, house. Uh, James Webb just came in. So his bids won't be on the screen. He just hit it for 50. But uh, we do have a reserve on it, guys. Because uh, like I said, this is a piece you don't find these very often. Not very often at all. 55. Uh, 55. It's a cobbler's bench. Well, it's Mitchell. A, it's 55. 55. 75. I got 75. James not for it, <laughs> James looking at it in person here. I'll, I'll tell you that if it's met the reserve at the end of it. 85. I mean, it's an absolute gorgeous piece. And look at the bottom of it, guys, at the character that it's got here. It's a wonder they didn't put their name down there. It's what year? Virginia. What year? Like it, is, it is. It is nice. I about fell on that color two or three times. Got 85. It's 90. Like I said, I don't think I don't think it. And the reserve is not real uh, stupid high. I think it's a uh, probably a a third or half of what it's actually valued at. What you got, man? We're at 85 dollars with West Mitchell. 95 bucks. Got 95, 95. from James. And if I was valuing this, this is not what my reserve is. But if I was valuing this cobbler bench, I'd value it from three hundred to about four hundred dollars. Got a hundred. That's what I'd value it at. How you doing, Hidden? Good to see you, brother. Shipping a, is extra, Amy. You're correct. Yes, Amy. The shipping will be extra, but at the price that my reserve is getting close to my reserve, and I'm saying that I value this as my personal opinion. And y'all know how them, those are from around three to four or five hundred dollars is, is what my opinion is the value on it. So anybody else might give you a totally different value. This is the first one I've had. The the first one that I've yeah, ever saw. Yeah. What? Yeah, I answered it. Answer it. That's my buddy there. And we're at a hundred dollars, guys. Hundred dollar be I'm gonna start auctioneering now. Hundred dollar be when you go one twenty five. Hundred dollar bill to go one twenty five. You're getting close to reserve, guys, and I'm telling you, uh, my reserve will be at least probably half of the value, or even a third, depending on what the value of this is, the true value. Right now, it's whatever I can get out of it, the true value. But uh, if you can get it at my reserve, you're gonna love it. You, you'll pay, you know, forty or fifty dollars shipping, uh, but you're gonna have a, a valuable piece here. And I'm at hundred dollars. Hundred dollar bill to go one twenty five. Got to get to one fifty, guys. And I'll go ahead and tell you, and that way we won't drag it out. But yeah, if you get it at one fifty and then pay fifty dollars, sixty dollars shipping, you're still gonna have less than the value of it. I believe that. What? <coughs> We're at a hundred dollars. 
Hundred dollar baby to go one twenty five. Hundred dollar baby to go one twenty five. Guys, I gotta go. The high bidder, I will offer it to at a reserve. Hundred five. I got one oh five with James, but that's my reserve, guys. And I got one fifty. I got one fifty. I got one hundred fifty dollars, guys. Wes looked them up too. Didn't yeah, they're rare. You don't run across. This is the first one I've ever came across, and I've been dealing this stuff a long time. Uh, I've seen a few of them, but they were priced. That was back when antiques, you know, the thing you got five, seven hundred dollars out of the site. But I'm at one hundred fifty dollars, guys, and I'm going to start my countdown because it has met the reserve. And I got uh, Virginia and Wes in one hundred fifty. Would you go one hundred sixty? Going once. One hundred fifty dollar bid, James. Would you go one hundred sixty? All right. James said he was out. Going twice. One hundred fifty dollar bid. Would you go 160? And this is the third and final call. And we are going to. Nobody else? I'm not missing nobody. Okay. Virginia, you are going to love this piece. I'm telling you, uh, Ricky, be careful with this drawer. And don't let it fall out. I imagine that's what they did. That's why it's got a little split in that drawer. Uh, sold it. Uh, thanks for bidding, James Webb, and everybody else that started out bidding. Uh, truly unique piece right there. If I'd kept it up here in Antique Mall, I would have had about three fifty on it. Something like that is what I would have priced it for. Uh, good piece right there. All right, guys, we're gonna do. A, we're gonna get to a few newer items. Uh, I'm, trying, I'm trying to make a mark. We're, we're gonna sell this while we're drawing for names. Okay, with the Will of Whitney. This is the International Festival of Toys and Tots. This came out of that uh, state. Maker of fine china. It's porcelain china. 1854. Edward M. Knowles. Knowles, you know, is the one that made the plates and the different things and uh, all that stuff. Wait till you see this, guys. It's absolutely beautiful. Look at this. Knowles Dodge. Not none of that cheap porcelain stuff. Look at that, guys. I've seen one of them. Is that a little Scottish boy? Got the kilts on and everything. And look, it's got the little... Uh, uh, I guess you'd call that. I don't know what you call that with that. Little elf or gnome or oh, gnome. Leprechaun. leprechaun. Leprechaun probably, yeah. yeah leprechaun. But this is, I, I'm not going to take it out of the box, guys. But look how beautiful that is. And I'm going to make sure she don't fall over out of the box. It's got the little leprechaun with it. And Ricky, go and draw a, a number, a, a register number first. Uh, congratulations on that buy, Virginia and West. That was a great buy. Somebody sent me in about $30 on this. Beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. $30, baby, to go first. $30. This will be an heirloom. This will be an heirloom. Wait a minute, I got one more chip, Ricky. No, that's my chips. That's not my. This the, is the numbers. That's yeah, I need the, just the uh, oh, register, number. register people. And I got a new one. I th who was that? The day, the day lady. What's her name? Penny Day. Penny Day. Wait a minute, Ricky. Put her, oh. number, put her number down in there and shake it up again. We got Don in at ten dollars. Wow, y'all are off on this. I'm telling you. Ten fifty six. Becky. Tell us who the bidder number is. Ten fifty six. Ten fifty six. And we're only at ten guys, and y'all are wrong, wrong, wrong here. This ain't one of the cheap porcelain dolls. This Robert is a Severson. nice fine china. Who? Oh. Severson. Severson. John and Robin. John and Robin. Robin, are you with us? John and Robin, are you with us? Twenty done. John and Robin. Severson. You have 30 seconds to tell us if you're here. Where was the doll made? Uh, they were made by Knowles. Let me see what the certificate, what did it say I read on that? What did I do with that? Hi, Kathy Scott. I wondered where you were earlier. So give me my, my big my magnifying glass. Rick. Look right there. No, they put Penny Made of fine china name in there it's made of china it's made of china i don't think it was made in china mildred that's what i'm trying to see it's fine china it's made by the Knowles company i 
I don't want to pull the tag off. It's made in Taiwan. They were produced in Taiwan. I'm fixing to draw again. They were produced in Taiwan, Mildred. Absolutely gorgeous. Go ahead and draw again. They're not with us. Uh, she's been back there working, going through the pallets. Uh, we're going to get her up here and maybe sell it a little bit. She's been hard at it back there. Thirteen eighty nine. Kathy Grant, it was Robin or John Severson. Taylor. What? Becky Taylor. Becky Taylor. Yeah, the, the first bidder number was uh uh Robin or, or John Don is Robin or John Severson. What's Don mean I said? I he mean. thought we said Don. I oh. Uh but well the only one bidding, I guess Mo's gonna get that. Don, are you out on that hunt? He was trying to concentrate on us drawing names. Drawing. We'll give him a second, Mildred. That's all right, Don. Uh, who's that uh, bidding person? Becky? What's the number? 1389. Becky Taylor. Becky Taylor, you've got 30 seconds to tell us if you're here. No big deal, Don. Oh, he's out. Sell out to Mildred then. $25. And guys... Another penny item of the night. Mildred won't be paying. Uh, I gave you every chance, Don. Mildred won't be paying twenty-five dollars. She'll be only paying a penny. And that was a that item right there. I think that doll is probably worth fifty to seventy-five dollars. I really do. I don't think Becky said. I draw draw another number, Ricky. You worse than this than I am. I did get the bottom. Twenty-four fifty-four. And we got a nice gaming keyboard coming up here in just a second after we get done here. Yes, it is. Ashley Orange. Ashley Orange. I ain't seen her on here. I've not seen her on here either. John Neely. Or John Neely. Or John. That's his girlfriend, John Neely or Ashley Orange. Either one of you guys say here. And you got about 20 I'm seconds. I'm going to don't say that. I'm going to go ahead and get ready. Oh, uh, we do have a case knife, Steve. Two of them. Oh, my goodness. All right, they're not with us tonight. Everybody's out enjoying a Friday night. 273, 273, Becky. That is not a bid. I mean, that's the bid number. That's not the item number. Mary Keith. Who? Mary Keith. Mary Keith. I've seen her on here. Mary Keith, I've not seen her on it, but she may be watching. Mary Keith, you have 30 seconds to tell us if you're here. And go ahead and get a chip number for the item. I'm not going to sell one until we actually spin the wheel. I'm going to go ahead and draw the item number. And item number 30, Becky, that was early on in the auction. I'm laying, early. These, I'm laying these down, these chips down okay. there. There's your tea. Oh, thank you. Y'all miss me and Ricky eating seaweed up here. While oh, we man. My stomach's still hurting. <laughs> you want to try some? Becky's going to type that in. <laughs> All right, Mary's not here. I got so. 20 bucks to eat it. But I'll tell you what, it was pretty nasty. I'm telling you. I'll wait till Becky. I uh, ate three pieces of it. Tastes like sardines. Uh, Mildred, Mildred's on a roll tonight. Mildred, uh, did she spin earlier? No, she got the penny out of it. But Mildred, you've got 30 seconds. You're going to get to spin the wheel. She's here, so you can go ahead and put them up. Uh, yes, and she she'll spin first. Out. Becky, uh, bidder number I-35. The registered bidder number 935. I-35, Jeff Reynolds. Jeff, Jeff Reynolds, Reynolds, are you watching? That's our buddy right there. If Jeff Reynolds is watching, Mildred said here. We're going to spin the wheel, Jeff guys. Jeff was on here earlier. And then we got some case pocket knives. We're going to move along. Where's Bill Horvath at? Jeff says he is. He's here. Oh, he's here. There you go. All right. And Mildred's done said spin. <laughs> Mildred's a, a person after my own heart. I like to gamble, too. Matter of fact, I wish they'd hurry him open up that boat up there. Was they open yet? When they open it? Oh, man. We'll all make a road trip. Don't Jeff be no watching that night. The money. Jeff's going to take the money? The wow. And now Mo got to spin first. So, Jeff, we're going to uh, let Mo's going to spin. And she was the item winner, right? 
Yes. And then Jeff will ask you again, but he will see what you would have won. All right, good luck, Mike.